Hey guys, Josh here, and welcome back to Story of Season. Uh, sorry, welcome back to Rune Factory 4. Welcome back to another live stream. I hope you guys are doing good. Hi, Rox. Oh, you're gonna miss the stream. That's too bad, but hopefully, you can watch it back later or. Maybe I'm gonna see you in the Rune Factory 5 stream next week because this week, this Wednesday, is the last time that I'm streaming Rune Factory 4 because next Wednesday on the 20th, but next Wednesday is the 19th, but with the time difference. Anyway, next Wednesday we're gonna be playing Rune Factory 5, so I'm super, super excited for that. I hope you guys are as excited as me. And we're gonna skip the opening and we're gonna just jump into it. And yeah, I hope you guys are good. Hi, Blue Dart, Caitlyn, Besson. I hope you guys are good. Yeah, hi, Brim. I've been waiting all day to play Rune Factory. I was just so excited for this. <laughs> so, okay, I'm not sure. Okay, so last time we went to the rod water temple, water ruins, and we got the, the little rune. And now I think the other one is gonna be in Obsidian Welcome. Temple, Welcome. Obsidian Mansion, I mean. And yeah, so let's see if we can do that today. Hi, Caleb. I'm doing pretty good. Next week is five. Yes, Run Factory five next week, seven days. So last Run Factory four stream today. Um, yeah, so we're gonna try to make as much progress as we can. I wanted to kind of finish Rune Factory 4 completely before starting Rune Factory 5, but I don't think with my work schedule and everything, I don't think at the point where I am right now, I don't think I'm going to be able to finish everything. Oh, actually, yeah, I don't think I'm going to be able to finish everything, but that's okay. It was still a lot of fun to play Rune Factory 4, and yeah. Hi, Michaela. Hope you're good. So, yeah, let me just get that bronze i'm running out is that copper or bronze anyway, yeah bronze let me get that i'm running short on that it's just a week between the streams and i always forget <laughs> what we're doing last time thanks for the little summary yeah i al i also forget uh, actually i played a little bit yesterday like like just a few days in game like one or two days just before going to bed um, but yeah, I didn't like make any real progress, so you guys are not missing out on anything. In the post game right now, ooh, just finished today, that's good. Oh, yeah, that's not, yeah, I have to use the other entrance. Yeah, never mind. Oh, yeah, oh, <laughs> well, that's a good way to, alright. So, um, yeah, I'm not sure where is gonna be that thing, but we're gonna figure it out. Yeah, I never finished Rune Factory 4, and it seems like I'm not, <laughs> I'm not gonna finish it. But maybe when I'm done with Rune Factory 5, I'm gonna be coming back to it. Or maybe, oh yeah. Oops, <laughs> I thought it was a monster. Okay, it's mine actually. Um, can you imagine if I had to finish Rune Factory 4 before going to 5? Yeah, I don't think. I don't think I'd be able to do that. So, yeah, I'm not sure where I have to go. Oh, there's some stuff here. Oh, 1,800 G. Oh, Steel Edge. Oh, okay, let's see if there's anything interesting. The lock has been opened. Oh, okay. Oops, I always, <laughs> I always think that's a monster, but that's mine. Oh, Intelligent Glasses. What's that? Oops. Oh, I keep... Ah. So clumsy. I don't know why every time I want to... Like, I don't know why I keep pressing uh, that. Alright, what's that? Intelligence plus 10. And this ribbon is death. So yeah, I'm gonna keep that ribbon. What about this? Attack 50, oh, 58. And that's gonna be a lot faster, right? Because it's dual blade. So let's try that. There's just too many games. I have a huge backlog to... Yeah, you guys have no idea... Um, <laughs> just on the Switch, I have quite a big backlog, but, like, I have so many games on the PS4, PS3 that I have to finish. I have, so m I have like, so many games on Steam that I bought because they were on sale and, like, I never played. <laughs> uh, this is too much. Okay, so, I'm not sure where I have to go, so, I'm gonna go over there. Yeah. 
I decided I want to try and finish the third arc before 5 comes out. Yeah, I mean, if you're not ordering the Japanese version, I think... I think you have plenty of... Like, you still have a few months left. And, I mean, Run Factory 4 is a long game, but I think you're... That is so strong! My This new weapon is so strong! How come I didn't find that earlier? Yeah, hopefully you should be able... There is a safe transfer from 4 to 5, don't know what... Yeah, I think you can unlock... If I'm not wrong, I think... You unlock, like, the costumes. Like, the main character's costume or something like that. Uh, but in any case... So, I'm playing on the North American version of Rune Factory 4. And I'm gonna be playing the Japanese version of Rune Factory 5. So... That's not gonna work for me. Well, yeah, that's not gonna work until the North American version comes out. Um, unfortunately, so I'm not gonna be able to discover... To check that out. Oh my gosh, these guys are so strong. Oh, there's a treasure here. Okay, let's just go in the next room. Yeah, I'm not sure where... Someone said, actually, it might not even be true. I don't know. Someone said there's a room in the Obsidian Mansion. But I don't know if that's good information or not. So, because it seems like... Do I have to beat? No, I don't think. Maybe that's not correct. So, does anyone know? So, I went to the water thing to get one, the, the water rune. And I'm not sure where I have to go. Steam is literal hell. <laughs> I feel like they have stuff on sale all the time and you just keep buying. I know, especially like when they have like like Christmas and stuff. There's always so many good sales. I've been working on the third arc since last year, but I think I'm close to the end. I see, yeah. Hopefully you can make it in time. Yeah, I'm not too sure where to go now. Also, let me know, guys. I don't know if the audio of the game is too low. So if if it's too low or anything, please let me know. Yeah, I'm not sure. I'm not sure where to go from now. I'm pretty sure you have to talk to the villagers to unlock the next area with the fall in winter fields. I see. Maybe that's what I have to do. Sound is good for me. That's good. Yeah. <clears throat> I know there's an event in town, but I'm not sure how to trigger it. So... Yeah, let's talk to everybody and see if anyone, let's see if anything happens. Do you know where the rune sphere is? No. Let's try to get some clues. Hi. Welcome. Summer's almost here. Yeah, it's the last day. Wait, is there 29 days? I'm not sure how many days there are in one season, but it's going to be summer quite soon. Hi, KZ. Hope you're doing good. Smart friend. Oh, who's that? I'm gonna keep traveling so I can be famous someday. Good to meet you. Nice to meet you. I don't know who you are. Yeah, I'm not sure. <laughs> really not sure where to go. 30. Oh, okay, so there's 30 days. So we have two more days left. Well, pretty much just one day left. This is the first time we've talked here, isn't it? Oh, yeah, you're right. Well, then welcome to my office. Parkalin was kind enough to lend me a room he was not using at the time. And I've just finished moving my paperwork here from the palace. Wow, I work mainly with other stars and businesses. I'm afraid you won't be able to help with most of it. Oh, but there's one thing. Just are you familiar with the harvest report? No. Weather and other conditions determine whether your harvest is bountiful or poor. 
A harvest report can predict what may be coming. In this geographical area, the predictions are good for about one week. I try to have the next week's report fully prepared by Friday. I'm sure that can be some very useful information when farming. Would you like a more detailed explanation? I'm okay, but actually, I don't remember this. Are you certain this is very useful information? No, I got it. Actually, I, I just don't feel like listening too much. But show me the harvest report and I guess we... So this week's harvest report, bumper, white crystal, poor cabbage. Bumper, radish, poor... Oh, let's see. Yeah, let's see if he has anything to say. No. Yeah. Hi Josh, how are you doing today? Hi Rachel, I'm doing pretty good, thanks. I hope you're good as well. So, if you're just catching up, last time we got a rune in the water temple. Well, and now I'm a bit lost, <laughs> I'm not sure where I have to go. L and minus should open the calendar at any time if you want to check it. Oh yeah, true. There's more than one rune sphere, but that's the only one I know of. Try asking around. Yeah, well that's what I'm doing and I feel like I've asked everybody once. So... I'm really not sure. I don't think Parkaline will know anything about that. Yeah, no. Mm, who didn't we ask? Oops. I think I just <laughs> picked up a flower by accident. Uh, I think he's hanging around the lobby. Oh, okay, so let's see if there's... Let's check with that uh, traveler. I heard you have a blue gem. Yeah, listen up. I got it. I had the blue gem right in my hands. It was the most beautiful gem I have ever seen. So I just had a feeling I knew it was worth something. Oh no, did you sell it? I didn't. After all, after finally stumbling on a real treasure, I lost it just like that. A monster done took it from me. Oh no. A monster. Hmm. Of course, I ran after it, but it went into a cave. And there were so many monsters in there that I couldn't follow it no more. So I just came back with my tears. Darn shame it was. Oh no. Can you tell me where that cave is located? Uh, past the bridge. Okay. Past the bridge in the south of Obsidian Mansion. And you'll get to Autumn Road. That's where the cave is. There's a huge dump near the cave so you can use that as a landmark. Thank you very much. You plan going there? I'll tell you one thing. You'd better give it up. There were monsters everywhere. Alright, that's okay. So, alright. Let's go over there. So we have to go near Obsidian Mansion. Oops, actually, let me go to the airship. And obsidian mansion. And should be south, so I think that's the little area that I, I have not been to yet. And I'm guessing we're gonna have a volcano or uh, something's gonna happen to unlock the area. Oh wait, the bridge? Was the bridge there before? I feel like I don't remember. Oh wow, 5,000 G- oh my gosh. Was the bridge always there? I feel like it wasn't there, but I have no idea. Ah, these guys are so cute. First. They're not too bad, right? They're not too bad. Oh, I figured a dual blade dash attack attack while dashing to jump forward and slice. Ooh. Oh, I don't like this. That's pretty good. I just unlocked right after talking to him. Oh, I see. All right, that's good. Then. Oh, let me just heal. I don't want. I don't want to go to the doctor and lose all of my hard-earned money that I just got. What a large st stump. There's a cave nearby. Palm cap. <laughs> like they're not doing it, they're barely even trying. Alright, that's pretty simple. Now let's get some ores. And I think that's some silver, so using that we're gonna be able to make probably better tools. And what we have now, oops. Alright, so let's see if we can go over, oops, over there. 
Is it in here? All right, so I'm just gonna save. Oops, I think, yeah, I <laughs> destroyed my... Oh, you get a lug from that, I didn't know. Okay, so before we go into the cave, I think it's already late. So I think I'm gonna go home and maybe like we, I can go there at the beginning of the day or just a little bit early. Kind of mean that the enemies look so cute. I feel bad for killing them. Yeah, while well, you're not killing them, you're just <laughs> returning them to the forest of beginning. So if that makes you feel a bit better, you're not really killing them. But yeah, they do look pretty cute. So I think there's no way, yeah. That's it for that area. Will you play It Takes Two? Um, I think I've heard of it. I'm not sure. Um, I don't remember. <laughs> I don't remember what it is. But... Yeah, that's not on my list of things to play at the moment. Maybe eventually. And here you can do some fishing. And then let's see what's over there. Oh, some new mushrooms. Let's just explore the area. Oh, we've got another little fishing area here. So I don't know if there's some special fish. That area is quite... Oh, what's that? Oh. Nice silver, some glove. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> well, it's too bad. All right, let's go home. And now, okay, let's see if there's anything I can sell. Mm -mm -mm -mm. So I think my old sword isn't going to be useful anymore. And that's pretty much it. Let's put this away. And I think I might have enough wood and lumber and everything now to yes. do the first how I expand oh I was given 2,000 gold as a bonus I don't know bonus for what uh, I didn't read but let's see um let's begin my print duties okay all right so let's see development and expand room Yay! All right, so let's see how that looks. So let's see if there's anything else I can expand the fridge. Um, yeah, there's not much more else I could do. All right, so let's see how big. Hi, Josh. Hi, Chat. It's been a little while. Hi, Growly. Hope you're doing good. Yeah, it's been a little while. So I think, oh yeah, we've got, okay, let me just pick this up. I didn't remember where the extensions, where the house extensions were. So I think I can pick this up. So this area is going to be just for cooking. Oh gosh. Yeah. That's so much bigger. Yes. Oh, sh oh maybe should we put a kitchen here? I feel like, yeah, this little area is just way too small for a kitchen, right? So let's just move everything. Yeah, let's put this here. It's kind of annoying. I feel like when the monsters just follow you around, but I, <laughs> I need them, but they're a little bit annoying. To line things up properly. Uh, 
Uh, I wish there was like a clear... <laughs> I really wish there was like a clearer kind of grid system. I'm just trying to line these two together and like my monsters are in the way. Oh, almost, almost. Just a little... Ah. Yeah, I mean, it's not perfect, but <laughs> that's gonna have to do. I was wondering if I was the only one who found them following annoying. Yeah, especially like when you want to pick up... You want to pick up something and you keep <laughs> talking to them or... You, like you pick up your crops and stuff and you just give it to them by accident. It's gonna be like this and... Yeah, maybe I can move this one. Maybe this one could be here. I think that looks pretty good, right? All right, it's getting late, so let's go to bed. Don't worry, in this game, you not don't kill monster, just send it back to the first of the beginning. Yeah. What dreadful weather! All right, so last day of spring. Oh, we've got lots of pink turnips. And all right, let's water these. I didn't have to water them recently, was it raining? Oops. All right. I'm just used to, in Story of Seasons, you have to press X for using your tools, right? So, or is it? Yeah, I think so, right? So I always press X. <laughs> I always press Y and I just kill everybody. Or is it B in Story of Seasons? I, 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 don't, know. I don't know, I'm not sure. I'm not sure anymore. Yeah, I can't wait for Rune Factory Fire. Just less than one week. Alright, so let's get our animal products. And yeah, and we're gonna go back to where we were. It's too bad I still can't bring Forte with me because of that event that's happening. Okay, let's see, 112. And what about this one? 112, 15. What about this? Three. I just wanna make sure they're exactly. Oh, this one's a little bit stronger. It has two of intelligence. So I'm just gonna sell this one. I don't ever use the gloves, but I don't know, I just keep them so just in case. Oh, uh, maybe I should go take a bath or... Yeah, I'm gonna go take a bath just to have full... You know what, I should have enough energy. Let's do this. You can play a game for hours without looking at the controls, but when you have to talk about... Your brain is just... I don't... Yeah, definitely. Like, for real, to be honest, I, I always mix up, like, Y and X. Because on the Xbox, even though I've, I haven't played on it, like, with an Xbox controller in forever, but the Y is at the top, and I don't know, I always, I always mix them up. Um, Alright, so is there... Yeah, Autumn Road. You missed watering one. Oh, no. Well, okay, so but at the end of the day, I'm gonna take a look again just to make sure. Thank you for letting me know. So let's try to just explore everything. I want to make sure I don't miss out any area. Ooh, screw, uh, screw rock. What's that? Ooh, that doesn't look very strong, but <laughs> we're. Oh, that is very strong. Okay, all right. So that's not too bad. Um, okay, so let's go Should we go? Yeah, let's go to the cave. Let's start with the cave and we're gonna do everything else a little bit later Oh, and there's some new stones Hi, hi Dania. Hope you're doing good. Hi Jazzy. Hope you're good as well Thank you so much guys for joining this last stream of Rune Factory 4 Unless I do an extra stream, maybe sometime sun Saturday or maybe, I don't know. But Sunday is going to be the story of seasons. And next Wednesday, we went back to fire.
Yeah, it's pretty strong, right? 140, 140 something. Yeah, it's I don't remember this area. I'm not sure la last time I played Rune Factory, I'm not sure where. I think I finished Arc 2 or something like that. So I was pretty far ahead, but I never like, finished the game. But I don't really remember this specific area. Actually, I don't remember too much in general. Oh no, my wolf has some. I think he's not able to do magic spells anymore, but I don't know if I don't even know if he has any spells, so I think that's such a big deal. But okay, I think he is good now. Okay, alright. I'm sick today but didn't want to miss this. Oh no, I hope you feel better. Ah, what's ah? Is there is there something I can drink to prevent? Okay, well, yeah, I'll just run. <laughs> just running away is good. On May 15, 20 p.m., Japanese timeline, there's a promo stream of Rune Factory 5 on Marvelous YouTube channel. Oh, really? Well, also, there's gonna be. Yeah, I know, actually. That on, so, on May 20th, actually, on May 19th, at 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, I'm gonna stream Rune Factory 5, so. Yeah. But definitely that Marvelous stream is probably going to be quite interesting too. Hi Mira, hope you're doing good. It's so hot today in my room, it's been so cloudy and rainy for the last week and today all of a sudden it's like really warm and there's so much sun in my room I'm just <laughs> so hot right now yeah, that's the problem when your pets when your animals follow you it's so hard to pick up the stuff all right so now we've just unlocked a little area let me okay where's my weapon this one Just slowly going insane. Oh no! How come? What's happening? We could use some of that rain here in California. Oh yeah. I hope you guys are not too... Not too dry. <laughs> so you guys get a lot of sun at least. Every... All the time. I don't know if I should try to tame one of these. They look pretty cute. Oops. Well, too late. <laughs> too late for taming, but I don't know if you can get milk from them or oh my gosh, my RP. My RP. Um is there anything that gives RP 3? Yeah, that's not enough. Maybe I could try mushrooms. Yeah, I think I'm gonna try that mushroom, but yeah, well, it's better than nothing. While the fire season starting early, this oh no, yeah, be safe. Still stuck at home in my state. Oh yeah, I'm stuck at home too. But a lot of my coworkers have been starting to get vaccinated, and for me, like right now, not everybody can get the vaccine, but. Um, yeah, I think from May 24th, I'm gonna be able to like book an appointment. So, yeah, after that, no more, no more staying at home. Well, I still, I still love staying at home. Actually, I don't mind it, but I'm gonna be able to start going some places. 
and I'm so excited for it. So excited. I don't know where's the first place. I'm gonna go. I feel like when I when I get my vaccine, like when I get my two doses, because you have to get it twice, right? When I get it twice and everything's safe, I feel like I deserve like a little trip somewhere, but I'm not decided yet where. Yeah. Hope you get your vaccine soon. Thank you. I hope I can get it soon. Recommend juice for a lot of RP. Oh, that's good to know. Maybe I can craft some juice or cook some, prepare some juice. I managed to get the vaccine early because I work in nursing homes. Oh, that's great. Lucky you. Okay, well, I'm good. I'm okay, yeah. <laughs> I don't have any RP now. Uh, that area was getting hot. So let's try to... Let's see if I can cook... Wait, is there a festival today? Oh, no. Okay. I feel like every time he's... Okay, yeah. All right. So let me see if there's anything I can cook. Actually, let me see if there's anything in my fridge because I don't even have enough RP to cook. It's two injections, 28 days apart. I see. Well, I think in Canada right now, uh, I think it's impossible <laughs> to get them like 28 days apart. I think you have to. There's like a three month, like there's a really big gap between your two parts. Um, yeah. I think it's a bit easier in the U.S. to get the vaccine. Um, yeah. Uh, let's see. RP 150. 30. Oh, bamboo rice. That's pretty good. Okay, all right. So let's eat a few things. And then someone said juice. So I don't know if there's any juice I can cook. This. Okay, let's see if we can cooking table cook something simple yeah actually there's not too much let me see actually i can probably buy some more cooking utensils cooking tools Welcome. apparently if you can get to Idaho, there's a lot of people who don't believe in any of it, so vaccines are available and open up point. Oh, really? That's <laughs> that's kind of sad. It's comforting to read y'all getting your vaccine step by step. We're getting back to normal life. Yes, we are. That's good. Uh, you know what? Let me get the new cooking license, the pro cooking license. I thought I wouldn't need it for a while, but I feel like I need it now. Oh, yeah, someone said I forgot. Oh, yeah, I forgot that square. Thank you so much to whoever said that earlier. Because I did forget this. I was offered a vaccine while picking a prescription. They said they had leftovers they needed to administer by the end of the day. Oh my gosh, that's so lucky. That's nice. Alright, anyway, let's get the pro cooking license. In the empty slots on the recipe, it is better to add uh, vegetable. Yeah, if you add something in it about the dish as an arrangement, you can make something dreadful. If you use high level ingredients, you can make a high level dish. When you make a dish without a recipe, it'll be fine. Oh, no. I. I I thought you could make a recipe without... Um, I need more RP, right? I feel so dumb every time I missed. I feel like this should be like so obvious. Oh, wait. Did I? Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> Vegetables. Oh, yeah. Something dreadful. High-level dish. Much RP, more RP. Yay, I did it. All right, so let's go buy the other cooking tools. Is it like Olive Town when you eat and get full? No, yeah, you cannot get full, so you can eat. You can eat as much as you'd like.
All right, so cooking tool. Let's see what's new. It's a veiled tutorial. There's no shame in filling it a few times. Yeah, for sure. Mixer. So I think that's prob 50 stone for a mixer. How? What? <laughs> what kind of mixer needs so much stone? Um. So okay, I guess I'm gonna go get some stone. And everything else is so expensive. Okay, so I want to get a mixer. So let's get some stone. There's probably some in my field. Don't feel dumb. I don't understand what's going on in game half the time. All right, so let's go here. Get some stone. So how much? Twenty-one. All right, that should be. Good. Yeah, that's the worst when your monster is blocked away. After that, I think I can go to the summer, summer field, right? There should be quite a few stones there. This game it looks like it requires a lot of work and in my days <laughs> I'm lazy yeah I mean kind of like all farming sim games but it is it is kind of work but it's a lot of fun still very addictive and fun oh I just need two more just two more stones and we should be good so I'm gonna go to the summer field Oh, and I'm running out of RP, so let's just do this. This. <laughs> All right, so we should be okay now to get the mixer. Let's see, mixer. Yes. Yay, thank you so much. So let's see if there's anything I can actually cook. Oh yeah, I don't have any recipe. So okay, I'm gonna have some recipe bread actually. Yeah, okay, let me put this Okay, let me <laughs> let me get the recipe bread. Um cooking bread. I'm gonna get a few of these. Oh, super well made. That might be lots of recipes in there. Oh, thank you so much. And one more loaf. Um, maybe what should we get? I don't know if I can mm, learn new tools yet. Probably not. But I don't know. Let's try. Oh, fruit juice. Yes, that's what a good timing. And farming. No, nothing. Um, yeah, so we can... Oh, butter, 300. Oh, wow, that's a lot of money. Um, and grape shoes, you need grape. So, wait, how do... Oh, you have to plant trees, right? Mm, is there anywhere else? I know apples you can get quite easily. I don't know if there's apple juice. Mm, I know apples are not too hard to get, but I'm not sure grape. I'm not sure where to get grape. So, I'm gonna put this in my kitchen. Alright, doesn't look too good, but. Alright, so I'm running out of our pee, so. And we already took a bath, so I think I'm gonna go to bed. And we're gonna wake up on the first of summer. All right, so first of a summer. Oh, and there's a holiday. Wait, I didn't know. Let's see what's up today. 
So today's the beach day. Oh, I completely forgot about that. So let's see. Probably there's gonna be something at the beach. My two besties and I saved for our birthdays and we're going out for the day when we can. Probably gonna drive down to Portland for donuts. Oh my gosh, that sounds so fun. Is Portland famous for donuts or are you just like donuts and you like Portland? Oh, that sounds pretty fun. Yeah, I'm not sure where I'm gonna go. I feel like I haven't traveled in so long. I think. When I can travel, I think I want to go to Hawaii. I feel like that's... I haven't been in a long time. Like, just somewhere warm after spending a whole year inside, stuck in Canada. They have voodoo donuts in one of the more famous weird donut places. Oh, it sounds nice. I should go. I've never been there. I've never been to Portland, but that sounds pretty good. good. Definitely worth it if they have good donuts. Good I've never been to Hawaii. It looks beautiful. Yeah. I've only been one time when I was working as a flight attendant. I had a four day liver in Hawaii in Honolulu so yeah I was pretty much <laughs> paid pretty much paid vacation just to stay in Hawaii four days pretty much so now okay yeah let's go back oh yeah so that's a beach day so let's see if anything's happening actually oh yeah <laughs> Dolce still has her little hat I feel like Portland is a good place if you're looking for a place to party. Oh, I see. Would you try to go back to your flight attendant job? Yeah, I definitely would. I mean, I just need to um, for the company to call me back. So whenever they need me, they're going to call me back. So yeah, I definitely will go back uh, whenever, <laughs> when as soon as possible. But I don't think it's going to be this year. Maybe some, I feel like I'm hopeful for sometime next year. Um, I feel like things will start picking up this year, but next year might be better. Paid vacation is <laughs> definitely a very sweet deal, yeah. Hey Josh, do I look juicy to you today? What? <laughs> Lumiere said I look juicy today. What is she talking about? The water is so wonderfully cool. It seems Dolce is not the type to like being fussed over. So it must be lonely for her to suddenly need to live in a town where she knows no one. Honestly, I'm a little for I'm a little worried for her. Yes. So what do I have to do? Is there is there anything is there anything for the event or just like people chilling in swimsuits? I'm not too sure. I'm not too sure. I don't remember that festival too well. What was your favorite place to visit while being a flight attendant? Ah, that was a that's a good question. Um Hawaii is definitely like one of my favorites, but I've only been there once. Um and the places that I would go more regularly, I liked LA a lot for the weather. And London was pretty good too. I miss London. I, even though the problem with London is that it's really expensive, but yeah, I like it. But I like, I would always go to different places, right? Most of the time. So sometimes I would go to like small places in Canada to like, not small places, but places in Canada I've never been that much before, like Edmonton or like Halifax or like St. John's, like smaller places in Canada that I would not that I didn't go before so yeah I think that was fun too so 
Yeah, why did I put the folder there? Yeah, just going to different places every day, every week. Having been a customer of LAX, I can't imagine that being a good time, but it must be better as an employee. Yeah, I mean... Yeah, I mean, I... There's no... Yeah, I mean, when you go to the airport as a flight attendant, like... You have, like, a special... Like, you don't have to wait too much, right? You have, like, special line. So... The airport usually is pretty good experience. Like, the airport itself, I don't mind too much. And, like, you have... Like, some people come to pick you up and stuff, so, like, you don't have to... Like, you don't have to think about anything, like, you don't have... You don't get lost in the airport, you don't get lost in the traffic or anything, so it's really... Like, you really... <laughs> you don't have to think about anything, so... It's not too hard in that sense. Alright, so I'm gonna go... Yeah, I'm gonna talk to Volcana and I think he has something to say about the event. Alright, good afternoon. Behold, are these muscles not your majesty? Where are you going? Uh, so, <laughs> I'm still not sure. Is there anything... Uh, yeah, I don't know. Oh, the flowers changed. Is there something to do? Is there something at the... F Does anyone remember? I, I think there's nothing, right? It's just people chilling in swimsuit. So we're gonna go back to our autumn place. I really missed some of your live stream because of school. Sorry. Oh, no, don't be sorry about that. Don't never be sorry for missing the stream. I'm glad you're here right here and now. So that's good. So, let's do this. You're not missing anything today, it's just a swimsuit day, I see. So, let's go back to that cave. Well, I still don't have a lot of RP, right? Um, okay, let me actually let me get some RP from this little flower. We should be good, right? We should be good. I think. Maybe not. Let's try. I'm gonna try to do it a little bit quicker so I don't waste my RP on all of these monsters. I'm just gonna beat the ones that I have to. Nigeria would be nice, but I don't have that kind of travel money. My stepmom and grandma went all over Africa. I have a really cool elephant hair bracelet. Ooh. Yeah, I've never been to Africa. Oh, charge attack. And when I was a flight attendant, like, we didn't have any... Like, we didn't have any flights to Africa, so... That's not somewhere I could go for work. I definitely like to go at one point. There's just so many places to go. They collect the fallen hair off rescues on Sanctuary and make things. Ooh, that's so nice. Yeah, I saw a documentary on Netflix the other day, like, about, like, uh, elephants, like, poachers, like, the people that kill elephants to get, like, their, uh, what's the English name? Dust? Dust? Right? And that was so sad. I don't know. If I don't know how it's called. It's been... <laughs> it was maybe like one or two months ago. Maybe one month ago. So. 
I don't remember how it was called, but it was really sad. And like rhinos too. And they were trying to find the people that were buying these. Like a lot of people, it's like a big market in China that people buy like ivory, right? Anyway. Alright, so let's see. Ah, that's really tough. This area. Nah, I'm, gonna <laughs> I'm gonna run out of RP quite soon. But hopefully Yeah, I don't think I, <laughs> I don't think I can make it to be honest. Yeah, no 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 no. Ooh! <laughs> just in time. Just in time. Okay, um, okay, let me go take a bath and yeah, I feel like I need to, maybe, maybe I need to either like upgrade my equipment or level up a little bit before I can do this area comfortably. Oh, it's closed. The bath is closed, so I'm not going to be able to do much. Yeah, let's, ah, that's the thing, right? I feel like I'm always running out of RP very, very quickly and then I don't have... Wait, there's probably something I can eat. Uh, let's eat that and let's see if there's anything I could cook. I think I'll probably move to Atlanta because my mom is full on the BLM thing and the streets are full. I see. Yeah, let's make some butter. I don't know if I don't even know. Yeah, I need to level up my cooking skill. Oh, let me see if there's any. I think I have more cooking bread. Let me see if I can cook some more stuff. I can learn some more recipes. Oops. Oh, apple juice. Oh, yeah. Okay, I think apple juice is going to be a little bit easier to make. Don't forget the free RP from flowers and rune stones. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. That's something. It's just I, I don't know where they are. So. Alright, so let's. Okay, all right, apple juice, apple juice. So I don't have any apple, but I, oh, 230 RP. Yeah, so I think apples are not too hard to find, right? <laughs> I love how Blue Dart randomly appears on the chat to give advice. Yeah, I love to have experts. <laughs> Some of you guys really, no more than me on this game so that always helps so i think these guys can drop if you tame them they can't give you apples right but i think if you beat them up no i think i'm not even 100 percent sure but i think they can drop apples so yeah that's just my guess but i'm 100 percent sure and i'm not sure where is the best area i think yeah, Maybe they can't. I don't know. I don't know if they can really drop apples. Oh, yeah. All right. So that's one apple. Oh, well, okay. Wait, and I just need to make some space in my bag. But yeah, we're going to do some apple farming just so I can have more RP. And then with that, tomorrow we should be able to do something. Okay, let me just put a lot of stuff in my fridge. There are three flowers in the summer field. Oh, that's good to know. Oh, is my fridge full? No, it's not full. Okay, all right, let me put some stuff away in my chest right here. Why does the, wait, I'm confused. Why does the radish, 
Oh, is that a weapon? Oh, they call. Oh, <laughs> I just, 81. Oh my gosh, that's. I thought I was a vegetable because <laughs> I grew daikon not too long ago. Wow, okay, I didn't know that. Okay. <laughs> okay, maybe we can try that. I was wondering, like, why can't I put this in my fridge? So, yeah, we're gonna try that. 81, so. Oh my gosh. <laughs> it's so big. Wow, the range on this is so good. Yeah, I know these flowers, right? Yeah, I just, I don't see them too well. Oh, baked apple. That is so strong, yeah. That's such a strong weapon. I have no idea how I got that weapon, but it's really strong. <laughs> it's really strong. Oops. Trying to get some apples, but I'm not. It's not okay. So I've got one. I've got two. I want to make a good stack of apple juice. Three. That's good. That's good. I want to have like at least ten. I think that's gonna be a good start. I think it's a radish. Yeah, it's a daikon, like a Japanese radish, white radish. I don't know if I got it by growing radish, like if you have like a random chance of getting this or... Hey Shark, hope you're doing good. Sorry, I'm just <laughs> I'm just trying to farm some apples, uh, but we're gonna go back to our dungeon a little bit later. I thought it was a disc <laughs> discolored carrot. Oh no! Yeah, it does look a little bit similar. And like, there's no. For some reason, there's like no texture, right? It's just like completely white. It's. I feel like they made this <laughs> weapon in like 30 seconds. Like the model is like very basic and there's no texture at all. Alright, we're gonna do it a few more times. It's already 8 p.m. And we've got four apples, just four. Okay, a few more times. All right, I'm giving up. That's too much work. Let's do this. Oh, all right, one more. Okay, all right, let's go home. So let's make some apple juice for tomorrow. Hopefully it doesn't take too much RP to make. Apple juice. Okay, so I'm gonna... Alright, I leveled up my cooking, so now 
I've got baked apple, that's pretty good for HP. But let me see, apple juice. 235 each. Can I sort them to stack them? Oh, they don't stack, right? Um, yeah, that's a problem. Okay, well, that's pretty good. We have apple juice. And now, what should we do? Yeah, I think it's time to go to bed, right? Alright, let's go to bed and let's try. Can we just put stuff in my inventory? In my storage? What's this dark po healing potion? Oh. Did I make this or did I get that? I don't, I don't remember. Alright, let's go to bed. Anyway. I spent so much money on merch today, it was well worth it. Ooh, what did you buy? Just some poor programmer spent a couple hours on that Let's texture list. The Carrot tradition, they're crying. Oh no, I'm sorry. Oh, did I get... Why am I... I'm always, I'm always reading, but whenever I'm not reading, there's something important. I think I got a recipe for something, but I'm not too sure. Oh! I forgot to check my... Uh, request box for a few days now so let's see harvest six types of vegetables make it delivery what should we do what should we do something easy wish me luck I've got an interview tomorrow and I'm trying to save up to move oh Good luck, I hope, yeah, good luck for your interview and good luck for <laughs> sitting up. Alright, so that was pretty easy request. And we've got a water laser, which I already have. And let's see, upgrade some armor. I think that's probably already done. I got a hoodie and a hat from the show Hell of a Bus. They release new pre-orders that's gonna help pay for more episodes and I wanted to help some out. Oh, that's so nice. That's good. I hope you can get it soon. Alright, so that's good. And next, maybe harvest six veggies. I don't know if I'm gonna have it completed already or not. So what's in there? Silver and... Okay. Okay, so I didn't ship six veggies yet. But I think once everything's ready here, that should be pretty good. Yeah. Bye guys, I'm about to win it down. Alright, thank you so much Mika and see you next time. It won't ship till the 27th, and even then, not sure how long it will take. Website doesn't see where it's coming from. Oh no. Yeah, I hope you can <laughs> get it soon. Actually, it takes me quite a bit of RP every day, right? Just for, just for watering my crops. Should I upgrade? Mm, I don't know if I should go in the dungeon or maybe I should just upgrade this. Let me see. Let me see if I have any good materials. Oh wow, it's so cheap to upgrade, just 16 RP. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna upgrade it once. <laughs> it just increases my attack by one, but... Um, yeah, you know what, I think I wanna save my RP. Let's just go... Okay, let me just pick up my stuff. Yeah, alright, let's go to, back to that cave. I'm also waiting on a shark stuff animal. Oh, that <laughs> sounds so cute. Oh, no, don't sell that. 
<laughs> yeah, I assume <laughs> I assume you like sharks quite a lot, right? So, Autumn River. All right, so let's go back to that cave and hopefully today I can. Oh, you know what? Actually, let me go to the summer field. Let me replenish replenish my RP first. Because I know, I know, I know I'm going to run out. So someone said in the summer field there should be flowers. Oh, yeah, there's one here. And let's see if there's another one somewhere. Okay, I think we should be pretty good like this, right? I mean, it's almost full. So all right, let's see this. It's very cute. The pattern is galaxy themed, so I named it Eskimo. And yeah, one can say I <laughs> admire sharks. Yeah, that's nice. Alright, Autumn Road, Autumn Road. Alright, let's do this. So, oh, let's make it. Wait, why is it not in my weapon? Wait. Oh, that's it? Wait, where's my daikon? Did I sell it by accident? Wait, why isn't that? Did I sell it by accident? What did I do? Why? <laughs> why is my radish gone? What did I do with my radish? Did I sell it? Did I? Oh my gosh. Did I sell my radish? What did I do? Do you guys know what I did? My radish disappeared. You can also hammer down the blue crystals in dungeon. Yeah, I know that. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, what did I do? I'm so stressed. Did I... S Wait, what? Did I sell it? That would be really stupid. I was a, that that was a really good weapon. I was really really happy with that weapon. Um. Oh no, it's here. Oh my gosh, the stress. The stress. Okay, I I got it. I was so scared, and like I didn't save for a while. So if I had sold it, there was no going back. Whew, I'm so relieved. Okay, all right. So let's continue. Let's continue. I'm glad it's here. We got it back. So let's go back to the cave. Phew, so relieved. So hopefully we're gonna be a little bit better. It's gonna be a little bit easier with this one. You can check your cell with car. Oh yeah, I could have done that. Yeah. Yeah, I'm just kind of <laughs> running through it because I want to save my HP and my RP. So I'm just going to go back to where I was. And yeah, I don't like these hot rooms. And the range is so big, right? So it's going to be not too hard to get that thing even when it's across the little lava. Oh, and it even <laughs> there's even the little radish icon when you have you seen that when you hit the monsters you get a little radish icon. Anyway, that's super cute. Ah, oh, these flowers are annoying. I was about to rewind this stream. <laughs> Thank you so much. Yeah, I kind of wanted to do that too, but that's <laughs> just too much work. Too much work for me. Yeah, 
Yeah, these guys are getting stronger, but it, it is a lot easier with that a weapon. It just makes a big difference. Should I try? Okay, you know what? Let me try to tame this guy. While these two are fighting the other one. Ah, don't hit me. Okay, let's give him... I don't know. Oh, did I? Oh, no. Um, I don't want to waste my food too much, but... Oh, oh, no. Um, big... I don't want to spend an apple on him. Um, what else? What do I have? Can I give him some potions? Oops. Okay, let's try with the potions. Oh, 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 I think, yeah. Alright, we just got a new beautiful monster. Exceed. Yeah, that's pretty good. I don't know if these give you milk like the other ones, but... I just thought they look pretty cool. Alright, so let's see what's up here. And let's get that run flower. Let's see if there's anything in there. Ooh, salted pump smell. And uh, oops. This so I think with this we can go back to the beginning. And let's just save here just in case. So I think that's gonna be the boss. But we should be pretty good. Let me just eat. Um Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna yeah, I'm gonna go like this. Oh no, that's not the bus right away. Oh my gosh, did, did they kill my guy in one one hit? Yeah, that's pretty strong. Okay, alright, let me just try to find the bus. Not nothing here. Ooh, a bread. So wait, that guy, do I have any antidote or... Yeah, uh, no, I think... I think my wolf has been poisoned, but I'm not sure I don't have like anything for that. Okay, let me go here and I'm gonna drink... Okay, after this room, I'm gonna drink some apple juice. That's pretty good, right? So, with two juices, I'm almost full. Uh, can I just skip this room? Yeah. 
Uh, I think after that, oh, hopefully, I don't know if... I'm gonna have to find a better armor as well soon. Because I feel like <laughs> I'm getting quite strong, but I just take like two or three hits and I... Just lose all of my health very quickly. Okay, you know what? Let's... I'm trying not to use my RP too much, but I want to get these stones. Yeah, the pumpkins he pumpkin heads are really cute. All of the monsters are really cute. Tomato... Oh, were they tomatoes? <laughs> I didn't even know. I didn't notice their name. Yeah, they are really cute. Ah! Okay, let me... Up. I want to try the charge. I'm not sure what these claws are for. I don't know if they're for crafting or just for like selling. Or ah, oh no! Oh my gosh, I was so close! Oh no, how much money you're gonna take from me now? 5,000. That's half. That's like 50% of all my. Oh. All my money. Okay, well, we made some progress, right? We're a lot further than last time. Hi, Josh, not sure if anyone asked, but will you be streaming Run Factory 5 on the 20th? Yes, I will. Actually, I'm gonna stream it on the 19th. Um. Yeah, because with the time difference, it's gonna be released on the 19th for me. So, yeah, same day, same time next Wednesday, I'm gonna be streaming Rune Factory 5. And, ah, uh, yeah, I'm very, very, very excited for it. Yeah, that's gonna be so good. I can't wait. <laughs> I can't wait for Rune Factory 5. I can't believe it's coming out. I kind of wish I had finished Rune Factory 4 in time, but I didn't have enough time to play Rune Factory 4, unfortunately. And, yeah, I also kind of want to do a little more of... Like, I feel like there's still things I want to... Of course, I'm going to continue playing Olive Town, even when Rune Factory 5 comes out. But this Sunday, during the Olive Town stream, I want to finish... Like, as much as I can. I don't know if I can finish, like, the fifth page of Lavette's request. Maybe that would be too much, but I kind of want to try to do as much as I can. Like, finish the museum. I think maybe we can finish the museum next stream. I feel like that's something that could be feasible. Yeah, crafting armor, right? I think that's what I should do. Let's see if I have any... Okay, I'm gonna need RP for sure. Yeah, I think I really do need an RP because like they touched me two times and I'm dead, so... Let's see... The, uh, this one, right? Make armor... Okay, I'm just level two, so let's just make stuff just to... Quality... I don't want to use like quality stuff, but... Okay, let me see if there's something else I can craft. Just to level up my craft. Okay, I'm gonna use that. Yes. Crafting level seven, and now did I buy bread today? I'm not sure if I did or not, but I'm gonna go buy the armor or forge bread. I'm not sure which one it is. Um, is it a farming bread? Is it accessory bread? I'm not sure which bread gives you the blue ribbon, amethyst ring, or roll ring. No. Okay, let me see if I have other bread. Is it the weapon bread that gives you the armor? At least you have a good idea from the fourth game. Yeah. Well, I did. I already played Rune Factory 4 before, so it's not <laughs> it's not like you knew or anything. But I haven't played it in a long time, so 
You can change the items you use for crafting. You just ought to put the highest quality. Oh, yeah, true. Okay, let me see maybe the farming bread I can eat now. No. Maybe it's the weapon bread. Let me see if I have some weapon bread. Okay, so I'm going to sell my shields. Inside. It's the accessory bread that gives you armor recipe. Oh, I see. I need to rest you all next time. All right, Jazzy. Thank you so much for stopping by. And I'm going to see you next time. Yeah, okay. So let's get some more accessory bread. Thank you for confirming. So... Yeah. Oh, I'm already level 42. Wow, we are level like 32 when I started the stream. So tomorrow, I think tomorrow my turnips should be ready, right? Okay, so, okay, let's just level up. Uh, yeah, because uh, I need to get good recipes. So let's just make some accessories just for... Wait, I don't have silver. I have silver though. I'm pretty sure I have silver, right? Did I sell? Maybe I sold my silver by accident because I'm pretty sure I had a lot of silver, but not sure. Maybe I used it for. Maybe I used it already. Actually, I'm not sure. Okay, maybe we can make some headgear. If I use cheaper materials, is it gonna be less... Oh, wait, did I do something wrong? Ah, did I do... <laughs> wait, strings. Oh, okay, that's not the right thing. So spider's thread's gonna work. Anyway, I'm just gonna use scorpion tail. You used it to make the shield. Oh, that's too bad. I wish. I should have used something different to make the shield. I should have used iron. Yeah, I didn't pay attention. Alright, I think we can get to... Oops. Almost level 10, but yeah, we might be able to make some good armor when we buy more accessory bread. Let's just sell everything. And how much? Yeah, should I sell my ruby? Let's just sell it. And let's sell this. Alright, that's pretty good. <sighs> I find this type of game really interesting, but I've never gotten to finish any of the Rune Factory games. Yeah, also, I don't remember... So Rune Factory 4, I never finished it. But... Rune Factory Tides of Destiny... Actually, I don't... It's been such a long time, I don't remember when that was released. But I'm not sure if I finished it or not. I'm gonna keep some for cooking. Yeah, I don't remember. Alright, so let's see if I got my uh, request done. Yes. So I harvested six types of vegetables. Oh, well, I didn't get any. <laughs> I didn't get any reward for that. Uh, ship a level 5 vegetal corn. 
sword flower. Oh, how do you harvest a sword flower? What's that? Okay. Use a nutrient, I think. Okay, I think that's gonna be pretty easy. So, okay, I think I can buy new seeds. Oh, actually, she gave it to me. That's easy. I think I might have unlocked new seeds actually right now. So if you want to use this. Wait, how do you use this? <laughs> how? Uh, formula one. Yeah, uh, formula A. Um, sprinkle on salt to grow crops faster. It's somewhat effective. Oh, okay, so I have to use it on a crop, right? Oh, I see. All right. So now let's take Elisa. They let you choose between Sonia and Aiden at the end of Tree of Tides of Destiny. So if you ever got that choice, you finish it. Oh, yeah. I don't. Yeah, I don't think I finished. Mm. Actually, you know what? I really don't. I really don't remember. I think I might have finished it. It's been just too long ago. The reward is a new type of seed. Yeah, that's what I assumed. So, green fire. So, I'm, I'm a little bit confused with the gardening. An item used to raise soil quality, improve soil ability to grow higher level crops. Oh, I see. And let's raise shipment rate. Oh, wow. I feel like 10%. I'm probably not there yet, right? Um, how can I see that? Oh, I think you have to go to the shipping bin. Look at the sales record. record. Oh, 7%. So we're not... I really wish there was that feature in Out of Town where you could see how much of everything you ship. But yeah, we're at seven percent, so I need to ship a few more things. Let's see if there's there's probably like a few things in my bag that maybe I can ship an apple juice. I'm gonna ship that today. Maybe yellow grass I can ship. Potion I never ship, so let's ship that. Ooh, one I need two. It seems like that's pretty good. Magic attack eight, probably pretty good for upgrading your tools, but. I'm gonna sell it for now. I think this sword, I can sell it. This, I can sell it. I don't think that's gonna bring me to 10% right away, but... Maybe it will. Staff, you know what? There's some tools that I just don't use. Cheese bread. Oh, wow. Sell 2,000. Oh my gosh. Our HP 5,000. RP 1. That's so good, but I'm gonna sell it. A healing potion unshipped. I'm gonna ship that. Material stone unshipped. I'm gonna ship that. Just gonna complete. I didn't know there was like a purpose of like selling everything, but it seems like there is. I'm gonna sell that. And you know what? I can sell that too. We might get to 10%. I'm not sure. And you're probably gonna make. I'm probably gonna go back to 10,000 G. Oh yeah. So, uh, yeah. All right. So let's see if there's any types of. Oh, finally, <laughs> finally that event got a trigger. Uh, it was soon after I woke up this morning that I noticed the graffiti. These flowers are very pretty. That's complimentary, I guess. Do you have an idea who the culprit may be? I think it might have been a ghost. Ghost. Yes, I saw the letters just kind of draw themselves. Are you okay, Farley? You look really pale. I'm perfectly fine, of course. Anyway, please leave this issue to me. I swear I'll find the one responsible for it. Even if it's a ghost. It seems like there's someone doing some graffitis. So let's see if we can help. Ghosts don't exist. Ghosts don't exist. Ghosts don't exist. Her knees are shaking. Oh, poor Forte. She's trying to look so strong, but... 
Graffiti on the walls, a vendor who simply disappears, a mysterious message, maybe meant to attract customers who would benefit the most from that. I've got it, the culprit has to be the owner of the flower shop. Wait a minute. This morning I saw letters draw themselves on our wall. Lumia was really happy, she said it was a new case. Alright. Uh, okay, so the shop is not open yet. Okay, yeah, seeds and nutrients, please. So... I know I have a quest. There's one of the requests that is uh, shipping Moondrop for Dolce, giving Moondrops to Dolce. So I'm gonna buy a few of these nutrients. There's like so many different, you know, I think I don't have to like delve into that for now. Okay, and let's check the general store. Good morning. We're just gonna wait a little bit. Oh, I wanna see, so I'm at 4,000 now. Okay, I wanna see if I get to 10%. Now let's see how much money, how much money I'm gonna make. Oh, wow, I made like 10,000. Oh, wow, that was, that was a very productive day. And I'm at, oh, 9%. So we just need one more percent for that request. So, yeah. Oh, actually, there's a few. Okay, let me just take care of my monsters. Actually, I feel like I always forget to brush them. Maybe I should keep a few ingredients for cooking, too. Alright, so yeah, I'm gonna have to water my crops, too. Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay, let's Morning. check the general store, I think. It's gonna open soon. Okay, yeah, so there's quite a few new seeds in summer. So there's carrot, the corn, strawberry. Grows well in spring and fall. Oh, but it's, it's still gonna grow, right? So maybe we can buy a little bit of everything. Five, four. Actually, yeah, I have an, another field, right? So maybe I can plant some stuff in the other field. You know what? Let me buy some more corn. Four fifty. Let's buy a lot of corn. And yeah, let's go do some gardening. Yeah, oh, let me check the ex Oh, another cutscene. We're getting lots of cutscenes today. So why is there a graffiti on the wall of the flower shop? I heard a ghost it did it, huh? There's this really creepy old house over on the hill, right? This a girl who'd lived there just moved into this town. Wait, isn't that? Hmm. Let's speak to Dolce. So they dot me. Unsurprising. Everything they said is true after all. Would you stop worrying so much about me? It's patronizing and I'm not a child anymore. Oh. <laughs> what? She really meant thank you for your concern. What? Pico. So, it <laughs> seems like Pico is the culprit. Let's try to chase them down. I don't know if she's running after the... No, actually, <laughs> no, she's not. I thought there was going to be another part three of that cutscene. But... Alright. Oh. It looks like this graffiti incident is spreading across the entire town. Clorica, no, I'm not asleep. I um, didn't see you were. Do you know if Forte heard yet that the graffiti artist is a ghost? A ghost? Some people suspect it might be Pico. Oh, yes, the half transparent girl who moved here recently. Yes, she's only half transparent and doesn't look like a ghost. Thus, she's not a ghost. Ghosts, after all, do not exist. They are imaginary things that the mind conjures when scared. <laughs> Forte, is something wrong? Ghost. 
<laughs> That's so cute. Only Forte saw what was happening. So let's go over here. You're the one who scrawled that graffiti on Granny Blossom's shop, aren't you? Do you really think I would make that much effort to do something nice for you? Do you have a point now? I've just wasted effort. What? Talking to you, what? <laughs> Move, you two. Have you have your lovers spot somewhere else, please? What? You got a problem with <laughs> what? It must be nice being good enough friends to argue like that. Is what you are thinking, correct? I see. This is your way of asking to die again, isn't it? You know, she's actually a pretty interesting yeah. person. Yeah. Right, so let's talk to these two guys. Ironic sign, hey? Ridiculous. Though he sounds like he was amused by it all. And what Doug has to say, never mind, it's nothing. What is your hurry? Running. I can see you were running with my own eyes, yes? No, have you seen a running sign? Signs are only signs if they hold still where all can see them. Where is that sign? What is Pico doing? I didn't ask for any help. Yes, it seems like that I was not asked to offer you help. Will you help me chase down that sign? Because the one carrying it, I know she won't be leaving town. Straying that far will snap her link to me, sending her to the afterlife. Ghosts can adventure too far away from the one they are hunting. And the one Pico has chosen to hunt is me. And so that's what it is. Yes, I see. I appreciate your help. It seems I do not is it seems you do not easily speak what you feel. Whatever. By the way, the sign you are searching for is the one presently behind you, yes? You what? <laughs> but I want to be honest, is what she's thinking. Die. No. Hmm, I see words that are writing themselves on the wall. Oh no. Interesting, it seems those words wrote themselves on the wall after the sign had left. What could it mean? Oh, what did it say? The owner of this inn is really pretty and nice. Her daughter tries very hard at everything. That's so cute. Oh, well, please be kind to Dolce. She wants more friends. Oh, no. Yeah, I can be her friend. Now, where did she get to? Hmm, I don't know. Maybe at the beach. Forte? Josh, I... Oh. There it is, Pico. I'm sorry, I do not know this Pico of whom you speak. There you are. Or maybe we're gonna have to go back to the mansion. Oh, why are you so startled? The sign, it just went over that way, but you're still here. Oh, that. I simply threw the sign I had been carrying around is all. And my lady was kind enough to fall for it completely. Pico, where have you gone? If you disappear, if I lose you, I don't know what I will do. Dolly, don't you worry, my lady. I'm right here for you. Pico, thank goodness. My lady, my lady, I've missed you too. I know. Thank you for completely falling for that trick, by the way. I'm trapped. Well, I'm strangled is more like. Don't worry, you're already dead, so you can't die again. Oh my, oh my. Oh, I see a field, a beautiful field of flowers. I'm a little bit, <laughs> I'm a little bit confused as to what's happening. But... Let's... Good morning. Honestly, you are such an embarrassment. Oh, you don't mean that, my lady. It was cute and endearing, don't you agree? Yeah, it was cute. Ah, oh, I see. That's a way of asking to die. Yeah. Oh, we have Vishnal in swimsuit today. Good morning. Have a great day. Have a great day, too. Now, be sure to stretch thoroughly before you go Welcome. swimming. Yeah, actually, you can't swim... Actually, you know, I think in Rune Factory 5, we're gonna be able to swim, right? Or... Welcome. Maybe... We, I'm not sure. I'm not sure if we're gonna be able to swim in Rune Factory 5. I feel like I've seen footage of it, but that might <laughs> just be in my head, but... Anyway... Ah, 
All right. So what should we do? So yeah, I'm glad I finally triggered that. Oh, so now that we're done with that cutscene, I think I'm gonna be able Hello, to thanks. finally, finally have Forte. Maybe I can have someone else. You need to be relationship level three, right? For someone to follow you. So maybe I can have, oh, maybe I can have Vishnal follow me. I want to be friends with him. So. It's so hot. Are you ready? Let's go on an so, adventure. I will gladly accompany you again when next you have some free time. Welcome. Oh no, so he doesn't want to follow Welcome. me now. Maybe the event is not finished. Maybe there's another cutscene that goes with that. Off to dinner. All right, Mira, see you like next time. You can swim in this, but you can walk over the water with special shoes. Ooh, swimming in five would be cool. Yeah, I hope we can. Um, okay, let's see. Town event. Yeah, there's no town event, right? So, yeah, maybe I'm not friendly enough with Vishnal, but... Yeah, maybe I can ask Forte and we can go back to that fire cave. Gotta go, Josh. Thanks for a stream. I'll watch back later. All right, Rachel. Sorry, you're probably you're probably gone by now. But <laughs> thank you so much. Yeah, I can't wait to have proper, like, <laughs> better equipment, better tools. Oh yeah, I want to see... Okay, let me go get some accessory bread and see if I can learn how to craft a proper... Like a real armor, not just a vest or a shirt, like a real, real interesting armor. So I want recipe bread, accessory bread. He only has like one bread a day recently. Purple ribbon, fireproof hood. Oh, is the fireproof hood gonna protect me from? Anyway, there's a lot of fire monsters, so that's definitely gonna help. But I don't know if there's a way to protect yourself like from the heat. Yeah, I don't think so. Yeah, I don't think it does anything for that. But that's still a lot better than what I have now. Oh, I need that. I sold... Um, yeah, I had that before, but I sold it. Okay, well. That's okay. Oh, yeah, I need to plant... Oh, yeah, I need to plant my new seeds, actually. I bought lots of seeds, so let's plant that. You can get two orders, which increases the amount of bread he sells. Yeah, I'm definitely... Um, yeah, I'm gonna have to do that. But I feel like at the beginning... I don't know, I feel like some days he has like two or three per day. Or is it like if you go every day, it's only gonna be one per day? But if you wait, like it accumulates, right? Kind of like the sprites in Olive Town. I'm not sure. But sometimes, like, he has a lot. Sometimes it's just one a day. I just noticed it was your YouTube birthday on the 27th. Congrats, your first year here. Probably missed the party on another live stream. Yeah, I mean... It's gonna be... My first video was on May 31st. I don't know if maybe I created... Maybe I created my channel on April 27th, but that's not like my real... Uh, that, that was just like creating my channel. But my first video was on May 31st or May 30th or something like that. So, um, probably at the end of May, 
probably on the 30th because that's gonna be a Sunday and the 31st is a Monday so that's not the most convenient for a stream but yeah probably the weekend before uh, I'm gonna do like a one-year anniversary stream where yeah I'm just gonna do like I don't know probably like a longer stream maybe we can play a few hours of Animal Crossing and like a few hours of Olive Town, a few hours of Run Factory 5. Like, you know, just play a couple of different things. And I don't know if there's anything like special I could do. If, if you guys have any ideas of like fun things. Um, if, if we play Animal Crossing, I think I can have some of you guys on my island. And we can do some games and stuff. Right? So, yeah. I believe it's random every day the amount of bread he sells. Oh, I see. Yeah, that might be. But yeah, we're gonna do something for sure. Yeah, it was the day you created your channel. I didn't check the videos. Yeah, that was a <laughs> my very first video was a tour of my Animal Crossing Island. It was not <laughs> not a really good video, but it was pretty pretty fun. Uh, a little stream party definitely it's gonna be nice I'm, i definitely want to do something i mean it's just one year but it's a good yeah i feel like i <laughs> should celebrate this little milestone island game sounds fun yeah we could do like a little fishing tourney a little like hide and seek and you know i haven't played animal crossing in so long well in so yeah in a little while yeah, so, alright, so we're good with our gardening. It's 3 p.m. Let's... I want to reach the 10%. Now I'm really fixated on that because I have that request I want to do. So, let's see if there's anything I can sell just to get to that beautiful 10%. You know. Love all, oh yeah, I should probably keep that for later. <laughs> Magic defense 35. Wow, that's pretty good, I feel like. Okay, let me see. Let me see. Should I equip that? I, is it safe to sell? I feel like that's pretty good, right? Magic Defense 35. No. Magic Defense 42. Okay, no, yeah, no. Okay, so I'm. S okay, I can. S I'm gonna sell that bracelet. Four. Blade Shard. Crunch. Cheap bracelet. One drop. Let's sell that. Turtle shell. We can sell that too. Fur. We can sell. The ribbon. I'm gonna sell it anyway. Purple grass. Yeah, I think we're gonna be at 10%, right? For sure. Okay, let me just sort things. Yeah. Oh, I have so many, so many seeds. I'm playing Animal Crossing while watching. I decided to reset my island. I really enjoy your streams. Oh, thank you so much. Yeah, I'm glad you're enjoying the streams, and I hope, I hope your island reset goes well. I know it's a lot of work, like a lot of things to do when you reset your island so yeah i hope you have a fun time with that okay i'm gonna empty that we still need to get you to 10k by the end of may yeah i think <laughs> that was my goal like i wanted to reach 10,000 before the end of may and like uh like before my first year and Things have been slowing down <laughs> a little bit because I couldn't, I couldn't upload as much. 
like in the last in the last weeks i just have not been uploading as much like as quickly and as frequently so yeah it's been it's still it's still growing but yeah let's see maybe when rune factory 5 i don't know maybe when rune factory 5 comes out i'm gonna go in <laughs> one week from 7,000 like 500 to 8 to 10,000 but I'm not I don't think I don't think that's gonna happen that fast so yeah I'm, I'm gonna have to move my goal to 10,000 to probably end of June I think that might be a little bit more realistic I'm playing cattails and watching oh I never played cattails how is it It's kind of really tempting to sell all of these because they're really valuable, but I don't know if I should keep... I don't know. Like, I could make 4,000... You know what? Yeah. Okay, I'm just gonna sell all of them. I don't know. I, I might regret it. So I might regret selling everything, but... Okay, I'm just gonna sort things out. That's so expensive. Wow. There's some stuff, I'm, I don't know if I should sell everything, but who knows. Very cute game. I see. I think I might have to try it. I've seen a lot of people to kind of talk about it. Alright, so alright, so I think definitely for sure we're gonna reach the we're gonna be over 10% right because that's quite a lot of stuff that we're selling Just need to make sure I don't sell something by accident Alright, that's a good cleanup That feels pretty good so, okay, I'm gonna go take a bath. Hello. And... Yeah, and then maybe I can reattempt that dungeon. Yes, yes. Yes. I just leveled up my bathing skill. Alright, so let's see if Forte wants to come with me. I'd rather not make this too large a crowd. Please ask me. Ah. Oh, I know. That's because. Oh, yeah. Because I have too many. I can only have two things with me, right? So let's get rid. Okay, I don't know which one. Which one of my two monsters is the strongest? Okay, let's see. Level 40, level 36, attack 343. I think Reap is a little bit stronger, but Silver is gonna get there, so yeah, we're gonna get rid of this one. Send home. And let's go with this now. So, yes. Yay! All right. So, all right. Let's go to the autumn. Oops. Actually, yeah. Let's go to the cave. Oh, but he's gonna go home at 7 p.m., right? I think. Anyway, let's try to do this quickly. Let me take my bike home. Oh, yeah, right. Yeah. So that's not gonna be too. Yeah, that's right where we were. So let me just try to kind of rush through this. This oh, 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 fruit juice, that's pretty good. It's 5 p.m. Tomato, tomato guys that look yeah. like pumpkins. Okay? These things are a pain. <laughs> 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 
I don't think Dish now is really. I don't know. He's gonna level up. I think he's gonna get stronger quite quickly. Oh, yeah, he's, he's really weak. I wanna see. Can I see his stats from here? Oh, level six. Okay, yeah. So he's gonna he's gonna get stronger eventually. But yeah. maybe not the best. <laughs> maybe not the best companion for today. But yeah, he's leveling up quite quickly. Okay, I think there was a portal. Yeah. And it just keeps moving way too fast. Alright, so fire crystal. Can I just re revive him? These are the worst, the most annoying monsters, the one that keep keep teleporting themselves. Okay, I'm gonna have to eat something. Get some food juice. Oh, he's staying even after 7 p.m. Or is it just Forte that goes home at 7? I'm not sure. Because I feel like Forte would always go home at 7, right? Or maybe is it 8? It looks like Silver's a little tired. No, 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 no. You're not tired. Okay, hopefully I can skip this room. Yeah. That's good. And let's skip this room. Oh, gosh. Okay, let's see if there's a portal. There's no portal. So let's just... Ah, these guys are <laughs> really a pain. Okay, I'm gonna have to drink something else. Yeah, this now is not <laughs> not helping too much. He, he does like three damage. But it's gonna get there eventually. Ice cream. I don't know when I got that, but that's. Oh my gosh, I can't. Wait, is there. A... I don't know. I feel like they keep spawning back, but. Oh no, oh no, <laughs> I have to redo the whole room. But I feel like it's not too bad because. Um, there's none of these fire guys. Actually, it's a little bit easier like this. It's just one of them. So. Alright, so there's three rooms. This dungeon is so big. I feel like I'm <laughs> I feel like I'm not ready not ready for this room. Okay, let's check these ones right here. Yeah, that's a really big really big dungeon. At least I don't have too much money, so yeah. I had just had like 2,000 something. <sighs> well, okay, all right, let's go to bed. It's not too bad, but that was not. I shouldn't have died. I still had a lot of RP, but yeah. Okay, let's go to bed. Yes. 
And now let's see, we've got some new flower. Oh, what's wrong? What's wrong with that pink turnip? I don't know if I forgot to water it or anything. Yeah, I really hope I can get... I don't know what level you have to be to be able to learn the recipes for the new tools. But yeah, I can't wait to have the better watering can. So I'm probably gonna be able to finish the request. Oh, let me see if there's any new things I can order. So like some festivals or yeah. So turnip festival summer 11, big catch contest. Also, there's the fishing contest and the big catch contest. So these are two different. There's so many festivals, right? Body battle eating contest. Okay, so I'm gonna wait until we're kind of closer to those dates. Before I order them, I want to use my points for maybe other things. And shops. Ooh, okay, there's a lot now. Blossom will sell furniture. Ooh, that's good. Illuminata will sell previously shipped flowers. Oh, that's pretty good. Blossom will sell previously shipped crops. That's good. More cooking bread. Okay, I'm gonna go for that. Because uh, I feel like I'm really behind with my recipes. Hi, Tiff Gamer 2006 I hope you're doing good. Oh, I can invite a merchant who sells gems to the town. I feel like I don't need this, but... Ooh, clothes! Yes, I want clothes. I didn't remember you could have changed your clothes in that game. Just east of Selfia Castle Gate. Yeah, definitely. Let's go buy some clothes. Okay, am I gonna keep my money? What? No, I don't have money. Uh, let's... Okay, let's see if there's anything else. Um, ability slot. Yeah, let's just check if there's some other shops I can unlock. Yeah, let's see. You know what? Let's get even more cooking bread. Yes. Alright, and I'm gonna get... I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna keep my points for other... For like, for the festivals. Next tools are level 30. Oh my gosh, I'm not sure exactly what level virgin you need to get them. Yeah, I'm not sure, but my forging is definitely not anywhere close to 30. So where's the clothing shop? I don't even remember the clothing shop. East of the gate. Good morning. Oh, wait, is that outside? Is that here? Oh, yeah, I'm selling clothes. Yes. Oh, yeah, I remember. Mm. Oh, so I need to get the furniture shop, right? That's nice. I didn't remember that. Okay, so I need to unlock... Okay, let me get the furniture. Oh, I think I don't have enough points for that. Oh, but I'm probably done. Yes. I can order a bigger backpack now. That's pretty good. Okay, let me see if there's any other... Get a shop license. Start your own store. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I, I just remember that. I didn't remember that. I love your channel. I have been watching and playing Moon Factory for a special also. Oh, thank you so much. I'm glad you're enjoying the content and I'm glad you're enjoying Rune Factory 4. So, business license, 1000 point. So, that's gonna have to wait. But I wanna do that, but I also wanna get the furniture shop. 800. Ah, oh, we're almost there. Almost there. Okay, I need a lot more points now. Okay, let me get my stuff here. 
here. So let's see how much, how many percent of. 12%. Alright, that's good. Alright, so what should we do now? I wanna get. Well, I guess the best point, the, the best way to get Prince Point is just by completing, like, going through the story, right? So I'm gonna go. Gonna go back to try to clear that dungeon. So, I'm gonna invite, I kind of want to get Vishnu stronger, but he's kind of, he's kind of useless for now, but I want him to be stronger, so I think, I don't know where he is, is that his, oh yeah, that's him, his face looks a little bit different. Time for training. Yes, time for fighting. Amazing. By the way, let's so go on an adventure. Yes. All right, let's try this. I just want to get some recipe bread and maybe take a bath before we start. My internet died for a few minutes, but that reminded me that your stream is going really well today. No lag so far. Yeah. How come? It's been <laughs> it's been going really well. I'm very glad that there's been no lag so far. I want recipe bread and all right, so let's get some accessory bread. So we've actually upgraded twice, oh, but he still only gives me two loaves, but brand glasses, farming shoes. I want armors, bronze bracelet, ruby ring. Yeah, I'm not getting. <laughs> I'm not getting what I need. So let's take a bath. Oh, I got 30 thousand. Oh, yeah, I made a lot of money in that. Uh, with my shipping. Yeah, maybe I can buy. Let me buy some clothes. I know that's not the best way to <laughs> spend your money on, but I feel like I want to change my clothes. I just finished Sharon's Maze and started a new game with transfer data as a male character named Matt. Oh, that's nice. Oh, I've been waiting for you here. This ice cream is for you. Thank you so much. Ice cream is really good, right? It gives you a lot of RP. Yeah, all right. So let's go buy some clothes. I don't know if you can try them or... Yeah. So, mm, what? Oops. No thanks. Yeah, you can try them on, right? So let's buy some thing. Chip's quick bodysuit is probably really cute. Oh, 24. Th oh, I thought it was 2,400. That's 24. Th 36. Oh my gosh. Red passion, blue sky, fruity lemon. That's kind of very vague, right? But I like yellow, so I'm gonna fruity lemon. I don't know if that's the same outfit, but in yellow. Oh! Yellow and purple. Oh, that's pretty cute. That's cute, actually, right? Yeah, okay, alright. I can't wait to see all of the outfits in Rune Factory 5. To, I'm sure there's gonna be so many cool outfits. Hello. Yeah, it feels good to change a little bit. Alright, so let's go to Autumn River. Alright, let's do this. I feel like I've been 2 hours 9 minutes trying to clear that cave. Looking good, thank you. Yeah. I wanna check, I wanna see, I don't know what the other outfits look like, like the expensive ones, like the soldier one and stuff. I'm sure they must be pretty cool. Okay, you know what? Let me... I never ride my monster, but I feel like... Are you even... I'm not even sure if you... Yeah, I think you're faster, right? But... Yeah. I never <laughs> I never use them, but that's actually... A lot... A lot faster. Oh, and actually you don't get... Oh my... I didn't know that. So if you... 
If you go in the fire and you're riding a monster, you don't... Like, the fire doesn't burn you directly. I did not know that, but that's very useful too. Like, especially like in this one, where there's lots of fires and traps and stuff. How do I... Just wanna, I just wanna <laughs> do that. Just press the switch and go here. I'm thinking of marrying Dolce Clark and have a girl named Chi Chi. <laughs> such a cute name. Yeah, I'm not sure who I'm gonna marry yet. I was thinking maybe Dolce. I feel like Dolce's. Like, she looks. I like how she looks. But I'm not a big fan of her personality too far, too, uh, so far. So I don't know if she's gonna become more. If she's gonna become a little bit friendlier eventually, I'm guessing so. Uh, but nah, I'm not sure. I'm not sure who I'm gonna go for. Good morning. Hi, Pika. Hope you're doing well. Welcome to the stream. The last Rune Factory 4 stream before we start playing Rune Factory 5. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. That was very close. Very, very close. Alright, we got it. We got it. Phew. Alright, next room. Also, you can't see anything, right? In, like in that other room when there's the... the thing. It's really hard to see what's happening. No, 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 Okay, let me eat something. Let me get the ice cream that Vishnal gave me. Where's the ice cream? Okay, let me this. Well, she's a great follower because she comes with Pico for free. Oh, I see. So Pico is fighting as well. That's good. I didn't know that. Yeah, I used to always just bring Forte with me, but... Oh my gosh. Okay, I just <laughs> There's so many, so many traps, so many flowers, so many fire. So much fire. Poor Vishnal. Yeah, I know. He just keeps, he just keeps dying over and over. Ah, and I'm gonna die too. Ah, no, no. Ah. No. Oh, hopefully it's not gonna be the doctor. Ah, it's always him. Five thousand gold. Oh my money. Why do I keep failing? Okay, I think I really need a better armor. Cause if I get stuck, yeah. Ay ay ay. Yeah. Is Bado selling armor? Well, let me check his shop. Is he selling armor? Money making, huh? Well, take your time. Show me the accessories. Welcome. No, he's not. Come back. Anything else you'd like? Come back again. Give Dolce hot juice or cake is her favorite gift, but she likes hot drinks and sweet, but not ice cream. I see. Yeah, I I feel like I don't have a lot of ingredients. Oops. I feel like I don't have a lot of ingredients for cooking right now. Cake, hot juice or cake. Yeah, I only have these. Fruit juice. <sighs> yeah. So what should I do? Should I try? I still have a lot of time today. Should I try this one again? No, maybe I should. Okay, let me upgrade my tool. I think that's what I might need to do, right? I feel like, I don't know. I feel like I need to upgrade my armor more than my 
tool, more than my weapon, because my weapon is pretty good, but... Yeah, I don't know. Let's do that. Let's upgrade our tool. Okay, where it is? Oh, I think... Oops. I think if I have it in my hands, I can. I'm not sure. Okay, yeah, there it is. The best way to level up crafting is to upgrade low level tools or weapons with overstock resources. Yeah. So I'm gonna upgrade this one. I mean, it's not very low level, but it's not like. Yeah, I'm gonna upgrade that. So is there something that has some attack? Does it even do something? Yeah, it increases the value a little bit, but it increases my skill. Actually, it goes up quite quickly. Have you guys seen the release? The, like, there's lots of trailers for Rune Factory 5, but it seems like the cooking is going to be like a little mini game. Kind of like, I think in Tides of Destiny, it was a little bit like this, where you have like a bar and you have to press like kind of like a little timing mini game very simple but still fun oh gosh that's pretty good but look at that <laughs> look at that rp i think i'm not quite there yet what about so is there any point of having like defense on your weapon i'm guessing not right there's probably no point Plus two. I did it. Hot chocolate is easy, can be bought from Porcaline. I want a dish or archer in the trade for item. Oh, I see. Yeah, I never see. I never. I never check what Archer has to offer. Can I? Oh, wait, where's my... Wait, where's my weapon? Why did it disappear? Did I do something bad? Wait. Wait, 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 wait. No, it's still here. Oh, level 10. Oh, it's already... Oh, gosh. So you can only level. Oh, I I thought you could upgrade infinitely and indefinitely. So, oh, so you can only upgrade things ten times. So I should have used better ingredients, better materials. Oops, oops, <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. Yeah, so you have to use good ingredients. I thought I I could just do it so many times, but yeah, that's okay. <laughs> It's <laughs> better to learn it now with a tool, with a weapon that's like not the best than with a very good weapon. Yeah, I'm running short on materials, which I need for lots of upgrades. So I'm gonna get some lumber and stone. Yes. Take it. Oh, his favorite is ice cream. I should have, <laughs> I should have kept the ice cream he gave me to give it back to him. Alright, that's pretty good. Um, so I already took a bath. Should we? Mm, I don't know. I don't know what to do. Okay, let me just. Oh, I'm gonna run out of apple juice soon. So okay, I think I'm gonna go farm some apples like we did earlier, just so I can make some juice. Let me 
me just see if there's anything to sell. Go get some apples. Ooh, who's that? Bold Troy. Rare can looks like nothing but trash, but if you use it to strengthen a weapon, it'll make monsters drop where I Oh, I didn't know that. That's a good tip. Does he have oh no, that's the only tip he has, but that's pretty. Did you guys know that? <laughs> I didn't know that. It's five PM. Alright, so let's try to get some apples. So, so last time, yeah, here. And that's one, that's a good start. Ooh, that looks like a fancy weapon C cutter. Three farming suits. Oh. Ooh, 184. Oh my gosh. That is 85. 180. Oh my gosh, that's more than double. Okay, you know what? Yeah, I don't have a lot of RP. Wait. Can I? Wait, let me try. Yeah, let me fill up my RP. Oh my gosh, 180. That's like double. Okay, wait, let me. Let me try to get some RP. That's really strong. That's really lucky. Sometimes when you use bad hot lean fat, give you hot milk. You can make hot milk easily. Tame buff moo and eat cooking bread recipe. I see. Yeah, I need to find more. Yeah, finally <laughs> a real sword. Yeah, and I just upgraded my other sword my daikon but that's gonna be a lot better dialas also likes hot milk i see they yeah, haven't been giving too many gifts so far honestly i feel like <laughs> whenever i play these kind of games like relationships is always like the last thing i work on even though i know like especially in this one it's kind of important to work on your relationships but I never do it. Okay, so I can't find RP. I think there's gonna be some RP flowers in the dungeon, right? I'm not too sure. Yeah, the radish was really cute, but you know what? I'm gonna sell it. Bye bye, radish. What about these shoes? The shoes are not really good, right? But. But they give me some fatigue resist FTG is that fatigue resistance? I'm not sure, but they give me some resistance to something, so I'm gonna equip them. That's pretty good. That's really, really good sword, so. Alright. Bye! Oh no, don't go home. Okay, well, so how come... Oh, maybe because... Okay, so maybe when you're not in the dungeon, he goes at 7. I don't know, I don't know why yesterday he stayed with me for so long and now he just leaves at 7. I'm not sure. Okay, alright. Let's go there. Let's go there. So, oh, is there any flower here? Someone said it before, now it's true. Yeah, <laughs> rest in peace, Radish. Yeah. That was good. He served its purpose and yeah, did a pretty good job. So, <laughs> that was a pretty good time. Pretty cute weapon. All right, let's do this. Oh, one more here. And now let's ride. This is so, <laughs> so far away. Hopefully we can finish everything today with that new weapon. <laughs> oh my gosh. 
And I'm not sure like which way I have to go because there's so many, so many ways. But oh yeah, so we got something new here. Big fire. Ooh, I I don't think the fire spells are gonna help me too much here. But that's gonna be useful anyway. Okay, all right. So let's do this. That's where I died yesterday. So let's not die again. Oh my gosh, guys! Already, already kind of cleaned up everything. That's really well. It's twice as fast, right? So, and also we have to mention that last time Vishnala was with me and like not really helping a lot. So now I feel like I have like proper support. Upgrade Happy Ring with Rare Can and Level 10 Big Power, Big Four Leaf Clubs. It is supposed to make rare drops happen more often. I've not personally tested, but I have read online. Ooh, I might have to try that at one point. Lots of oil. That's gonna be good for cooking. I'm guessing. Sure, all. Ooh. Is that better than my small here? I think so. Okay, I think. Oh, there's another sword there. I think that's the same one I had. Steel Edge. Yeah, I've had that one before. It was pretty good, but <laughs> I didn't use it for too long. Because I keep finding better and better weapons, right? That's the thing with this game. I feel like. There's almost, at, at least in the beginning, like where I am right now, I feel like there's not too much point in upgrading your weapons because you always find better weapons like every every few days. We'll make it this time. Yeah, hopefully we'll make it. Oh my gosh, how can I? All right, so this part is really tough, but we'll actually yeah. wait. <laughs> I'm not ready for this. Okay, all right, let me concentrate. I might not talk, or I might not read the chat. I feel like I need to focus on this. Okay, actually, I'm doing it. I'm doing it. There was a sword there, but it just disappeared because it dropped kind of outside the outside the walkable area yeah we're doing pretty good pretty good what is your favorite weapon type to use i feel like well so far all of the good weapons i've had were long sword but i like jewel blade i like to be like really fast so yeah i like jewel blade also in one factory oceans i was playing with jewel blades a lot okay this is gonna be a pain to try to get in the middle but I have to do it. Don't touch me. Okay, now I need to get out. This. <sighs> We're doing it. We're doing it. Alright, so. Oh, yay! So now we've got another kind of safe checkpoint. Another checkpoint. Can we just get what's in there? All right, that's pretty tough. Okay, all right. So let me eat some apple juice. Let me drink some apple juice. All right, let's continue. Are you guys ready? That's this. Oh, let me check the dual blade. Yeah, fifty-eight. Phew. So wait, <laughs> wait, where do I go? So mm, wait, oh, okay, right here, <laughs> actually, okay. Oh my gosh, it just kills itself. Okay, so I already broke one arm, broke two arms. Okay, so, so, hard. so far, <laughs> so far, so good. They're just my companions are taking damage from me, so pretty good. I just need to revive my. It's already red. 
I think this one is it's really not too bad like compared to I don't know I might be speaking too early and I don't want to talk too fast but I feel like so far like compared to the dungeon I feel like the dungeon was quite hard but the actual boss might not be too hard it was the same for Dolce Dolly right like the the manner was I mentioned was kind of hard but the boss was too hard Yeah, that was really easy. That was really <laughs> a little bit underwhelming for a bus fight. <laughs> All right, Rune Sphere. If I just take this to Obsidian Mansion, yeah. Let's bring this to the mansion. And yeah, let's just do this. So, actually. Okay, we can walk to the mansion. It's not too far. Oh my gosh, it's 1:39. Okay, it's kind of, kind of kind of late, but let's just go to the mansion. I don't know where. Like it says, bring it to the mansion, but I don't know like where. Maybe. Okay, yeah, so place the rune sphere over here. That's the third one. Yay, Josh. Oh, I finally found you. I've been looking all over for you. What happened? Venti woke up. Oh, she did. Though she's still a little woozy, the rune spheres, I guess it's actually working. I wanted, to let it, I wanted to let you know as soon as possible, but it took me forever to find you. All right, so let's see how Venti's doing. All right, that's pretty good. Finally, we're <laughs> finally making some progress. Up. Oh, soy herb seeds. All right, let's see what's happening here. Venti. Oh, Josh. Dog, what's going on? Doug? Dog? Doug. Ventis will answer my question. Why? Why did you kill everyone? Doug, Doug, calm down. <laughs> Just step back. But Doug has something to say to me. Please allow him to plead his case. All right, let's see. Doug, explain to me what you're talking about, if you would. Why? Why did you kill my parents, my whole tribe? Mm, Doug, I have no idea what you're talking about. Don't act all innocent. You did it. I know you did. Listen to me. I honestly have no idea what you're talking about. The Jewel Blade was my first choice, the first playthrough I did for 3DS version that had the best draw weapon in the game. Twin Justice, but I really like gloves a lot for abilities. Yeah, you know what? I never tried the gloves. Maybe I should try that. They're acting all big and selfless to fool everyone in town, right? Well, I don't believe a word of it. Do you realize how much danger your lies are causing? Causing good, good people like Josh. You call it friendship, but all you've ever wanted to do is use people for your own selfish ends. Doug, no, he's gonna hurt Venti. That's who Ventus Will really is. By the people of the Sech empires. I see. So, what is it you want to do then? What? What do you mean? According to the Sech, I'm your enemy. If so, you should have just attacked me, right? But you didn't, because you're still uncertain. That's not. That's why I'm asking. Do you believe what you heard from the Sech empire? Will you use that sword to kill me and take your revenge? Or will you believe me and sheath your blade? What do you want to do? Who, what do you think is the right thing to do? You're the one who has to decide. I, I, I have one question. Is it true what you said to Josh that you can't leave Selfia? It's true. I can't leave Selfia. Oh man, damn it. What's the right thing to do here? At set, they convinced me that she killed them, but now she's saying she can't leave the town. So who's lying to me? Ah, someone's lying. Dog, let's believe in Venti. It's hard to believe that Venti's a murderer. Who cares about your opinion? You're going to take her side no matter what? That's not true. If I thought Venti were in the wrong, I'd use all my strength to stop her, even now after everything she's done for me. But I don't believe it. I don't think Venti's the one responsible. For what you described, you heard her speak to the guardians. 
After hearing all that, can you still doubt her? Isn't that why you came to see for yourself and held your blade all this time? Venti tried to help a total stranger like me. She cheered me up when I was suffering and unable to remember anything about my past. Even though the Earthmates are the cause of her agony, even and even when the fact that I'm that I'm one was rubbed right up in her face, she still called she still called me a friend. Oh my gosh, I'm struggling to read today. Josh, that's why I believe in Venti. I want to believe in her, because she's my friend. Damn, Damn it. <gasps> no! What? What? I thought, I thought he was gonna try to kill me. This is a rune sphere. I honestly don't know what's right and what's wrong. My head is completely messed up right now. I still don't really believe that she wasn't the one. But at the same time, I don't think it's all a lie. I can't believe both, though. That's why I don't trust myself. I don't know what is the right thing to do. But you just... You've been trying to help everyone all this time. I don't have any trouble believing you. Dog. So you can do whatever you want with your rune sphere. Thank you. Shut up. It's not for you, damn it all. <laughs> anyway, I'll see you around. All right. So, the Setch are cruel to play with people's lives. Venti. What kind of place is the Setch's empire? Oh, that's right. You wouldn't know. There are a huge empire bordering Norad, that terrifying land, the Setch's empire. They've, invi they've, they've invaded us in the past, so I say with complete certainty that they are forced to be reckoned with the Setch's empire. This stone is called a rune sphere. It holds a tremendous power. I wonder how many runes are stored in that small stone. Yeah. If we place these where the guardians were found, those areas will fill with runes. I used axes and hammers from most recent playthrough. Fail crush is a good hammer and tornado swing abilities is so good. I see. You mean the rune spots so they can take the place of the guardians? That explains why I got some of my power back. But I had no idea such things existed. Me neither. I was pretty surprised. Where did you get it exactly? I found it in Yokmir Forest. I was chasing after a chip squeak. I almost forgot that chip squeak asked me to tell you something. Oh, at least I think it was the chip squeak. It said they're all watching over you. What, do you mean? what does that mean? It means you're not alone, right? I see. I'm going to the tower, Josh. With the rune spheres, I can release the guardians and save you. That's why I have to go. I can't lose you, Venti. Hehehe. <laughs> <laughs> but it is rather encouraging. I can't deny. I knew you were the right choice. Way to go, Venti. Hehe. <laughs> <laughs> I do have a keen eye. It's quite odd, though. For you to find something like a rune sphere around here, it makes no sense. Why was it just lying around? It's truly astounding, honestly. Thank you, Josh. Thank you. Let me ask you once again. I want you to save Leon. Will you release him? Will you release the last guardian? Relax, it's all covered. Wow. Covered in what? <laughs> Maple syrup, maybe? Ah, uh, this is supposed to be a touching scene, you know. Don't worry, I promise, Venti. I promise I'll save you, so don't worry. Get some rest. All right, good luck, good luck. I'm going to rest. All right, so let's go have some sleep. And then let's go to the tower. Oh, we're not done with the cutscenes. Lady Ventuswell, didn't she wake up? <laughs> She's resting again for the moment. Oh my, I see. How is she? Is she alright? Well, I can't say anything for sure yet, but she seems to be feeling better. Oh, Lady Venti as well. I'm heading to the tower now, so I'll leave Venti to you all. Tower, you mean Leon Karnak? I seem to recall that it's quite impossible to get inside. It's completely sealed off. What? Your Majesty, you're being disruptive. So are you, Volcanon. Both of you keep quiet. <laughs> Venti's just sleeping. At least we didn't wake her up. Since everyone's waiting, let's go outside. Okay, all right. Oh, everybody's here. Oh, wow. Why is everybody here? We all heard that Lady Ventuswell has woken up, so we rushed over. You're not the only one worried about her, yes? You're right. So, Josh, about Leon Karnak. You are saying it's still dust. Yes. A while ago, a mysterious gate appeared there. The gate has grown so large, it shrouded the whole tower, and within it, the air is... Well, the royal capital warns not to go near it, as it's become extremely dangerous. Will you be playing through Sharon's maze and also in finishing all requests? Um, so, Rune Factory 5 is coming out next week. So, <laughs> I don't think I'm going to be finishing Rune Factory 4, unfortunately. I might... Um, 
Yeah, because once Rune Factory 5 is out, I'm gonna play Rune Factory 5 and then I'm gonna play Olive Town. So, yeah, I don't think I'm gonna have too much time to play Rune Factory 4 after that. Why are you going there exactly? By. Okay, um. Right, yeah, let's place the Rune Sphere. What is? It's a Rune Sphere. If I take this to the tower, I should be able to save Venti. Yes, the stone will take the place of a guardian and, um. <laughs> yes, is something the matter? It's just that I feel kind of weird revealing everything that Venti's been hiding from you all this time. I'm curious. Oh, he said it would take the place of a guardian, but what does that mean? Well, I can't explain everything in detail yet, but I need you all to trust me. Yes. Without question. What? How can we not trust you when we're asked to do so? It's part of a butler's duty to trust his master. I've only ever heard honesty in your voice. Let's all figure out a way to solve this. Yes, we want to help you. Thank you. If the story about the gate is true, does that mean that the tower beyond it, beyond it is the forest of beginnings? Yes. Yes, that's what the researchers at the capital had concluded. It seems the inside of the tower has virtually fused with the forest of beginnings. So I'm guessing there's gonna be lots of monsters there. Something inside is causing an imbalance in the runes. Fusing parts of the tower with the forest and separating the two with a large imposing gate. That's why simply destroying the gate isn't an option. Unless the underlying cause is eliminated, it will just reappear once more. That cause behind an imbalance is the runes. It must be the guardian. So the forest of beginnings is within the tower. Yes, yes that means, well, can't you just break that huge gate and enter the forest directly? You know, by using the power that's released when the gate breaks. Oh, I see. I don't really get it. I might have told you before, but gates are passages leading out from the first of beginnings when a gate either breaks or disappears there's slight power that's drawn toward the forest if it's just a regular gate it's only strong enough to draw out some small monsters but when the gate is that big it could be a totally different story so if i break the gate and moon karnak um the energy output may be large enough to turn the whole tower into the forest of beginnings you might just have a chance of getting it but then there wouldn't be any way for you to get back I love your pretty tour of Olive Town and I have learned a lot from your tips and tricks video. Thank you so much. I'm glad you were able to learn. I still have a few tips and tricks videos to make for Olive Town. I want to do one for the treasures and I want to do like a flower and honey video. And after that, I'm going to have pretty much everything covered. Um, yeah, several years ago, one person made it back from the first of beginning. But I don't know the details as I merely overheard the story as the at the royal capital. Well then, let's all try to figure this out. Yep. Our mission is to come up with a way to return from the first of beginning so we can help Lady Ventuswell. Vishnu, that's true. There's no use just standing there. I'll go search the documents in my room. Let me help you. I'll try writing a letter to my hometown. Maybe we can hear a different story from the elves. To me. I'll do some research too. It's time for me to show how capable capable I am as a detective. Okay. I'll go ask the customers in town. I'm sure we'll find a solution. I can't wait for the honey and hive video. Yeah, it's gonna be coming soon. All right. There's not too much to it. Like it's quite <laughs> pretty straightforward, but everyone loves Lady Ventuswell so much. It makes me happy. All right, time to get serious and start searching. Okay. Yes, we have to do what we can as well. Absolutely. Let's all give this our best shot. I'm not sure what the, these two are going to do, but go. uh, I'll do more research on the first of beginnings. Don't worry. I'll make sure you safely return to this town. Blah, 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 blah. That's true. I'll contact the capital. Josh, please wait for us. We promise to figure out a way for you to return from the first of beginnings. Thank you. So is that going to be the end of the first arc when I finish that thing Josh oh more people we heard about everything yes. you're trying to figure out how to return from the first of beginnings right yes so you can help Lady Ventuswell I want to help you out as best as I can there must be a way to come back All right. I can't just slack off like I do with my store now can I <laughs> that is a long cutscene I'm go it's not done yet I'm going to help Xiao and ask around I'll also do my part, though I'm not sure how much I'll help. How much help I will be? Let's try to save Ben. Yeah. All right, with everybody working together, how can we lose? Whew! All right, let's go to. <laughs> it's 2 a.m. Let's go to sleep. That was a long cut. Okay, I think I need to go get some water. 
I'm <laughs> dying. I'm gonna, okay, I'll be right back. One, one sec, 30 seconds. Okay, I'm back. I just drank a big glass of water. I feel like that <laughs> that cutscene drained me. I've been working on my hives and stuff, but I feel like I'm not making the most out of it. Yeah, we watched a movie, <laughs> not a cutscene. Yeah. All right, let's sleep. Ah, oh, that glass of water was so good. All right, so let's continue. I was thinking if the monsters come from the first of beginnings. Can you also come back <laughs> by being a monster? Good question. I only have to get fishing to level 10 and finish, it, finish Lovett's quest and have a child. I'm a read Jack and I'm having a boy. If the cutscene will ever trigger. Yeah, I think it's. Is it two months after getting married? I'm not sure. Well deserved the water, they were talking so much. Yeah. They were very talkative. So I'm not sure what I'm gonna uh yeah, I'm not sure what I'm gonna do. Ooh. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do when Run Factory 5 comes out for the cutscenes. Um because it's gonna be in Japanese, so I'm not like I'm probably gonna go through the cutscenes kind of quickly. Like to get a gist of it. But I know there's gonna be long cutscenes, so I'm gonna see how I'm gonna do it. That's pretty good. We're getting lots of crops. Um, I don't know. I think. I feel like it took quite a long time to grow, so hopefully I'm gonna make I'm gonna be making quite a bit of money with these. And I'm gonna go. Oops. Okay, I'm gonna go buy some extra see I'm gonna water these, but yeah, I think I'm gonna be making pretty good money with that. Let's see, so I'm at 5,000 now. I think I'm gonna make like at least maybe 10,000 or something. I have no idea. And Ooh! Oh my gosh, 20. Oh my gosh, I made like 22,000 just for that, and I'm almost at. Oh, so I can buy. Mm, Wait, I can unlock the furniture. I have enough points for the furniture shop. I don't know if I should get the license for my own shop or the furniture. What do you guys? What do you guys think I should do? Should I get the license for my own shop, which I'm, I need 50 more points, or should I get Blossom's furniture shop and like buy some furniture? I got married on winter 11 year 2 and hope to have cutscene trigger around summer 25 year 3. Yeah, hopefully. I think you also need to be at 5, like 15 hearts, right? I'm not too sure. I'm not too sure on that because I'm not there yet. All right, so that's good. Now let's buy, so four. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven plus two, so four times seven. Yeah. <laughs> um, four times, seven. all right, so let's just buy, I don't know, let's just buy lots of corns. All 
my 28 that should be good right Thanks. plus two maybe two strawberries Come again, okay? where are the experts i don't want to make that decision i don't know anything about the game yeah <laughs> i don't know um i mean i have a request to open my own shop so i think i'm gonna go for my own shop first i just need to to save up a few more points Why is the soil not... <laughs> I think my animals are in the way, so... My, I mean, my, my monsters keep getting in the way. And I'm, my soil is not... Wait, it's... Wait. <laughs> it's wrong, right? It's, there, there, there's something wrong. It's off. It's completely off. Well, there's something, <laughs> there's something not right with this. Uh -huh. Okay, there's something really wrong with I'm not sure. I'm I'm not sure. I'm not, I'm really not sure. Oh, I think Oh, I just realized the grid is kind of like not has did I change some I feel like usually the grid is more neat than this right I'm not sure why no maybe it's always been like that and I just never noticed it's because you have the farming boots oh is that what the Oh, these boots. Shoes for advanced farmer that make it possible to cultivate regardless. Thank you so much, Jessica. That's why I was <laughs> I was really wondering like what what happened to my beautiful grid. But it's kind of nice to have it's kind of nice to have that option, but yeah, thank you so much. You probably don't need the furniture right now since it costs a lot of resources and the shop will help you earn money if you I see. Yeah. Ah, uh, yeah, that's gonna be a lot easier now. Okay, so let me, let me just clean this up. Uh, I was just making a mess. Oh, yeah, oh, <laughs> that makes a lot more sense now. That makes a lot more. Okay, I'm gonna leave these like this. It's gonna be. Yeah, okay. <laughs> it works a lot better now. I have 15 hearts with Jack and have seen 3 4 cutscenes, including picking child gender and coming home late. I see. Yeah, hopefully you can get your child soon. All right, it's good. It's raining. So I'm missing. Okay, let's plant. Oh wait, if I sell the seed, if I sell the seed, I'm gonna get higher quality, right? In the store, right? So yeah, level two. I'm gonna keep these for cooking. A giant fingernail. Mm. Okay, let's see how everything is doing on this side. Right. Oh yeah, I have a new... I completely <laughs> neglected that new monster. I'm gonna have to buy more photos. So it gives me horn and fangs. You have to sell crop nuts. Oh, I see. Yeah, I feel like <laughs> people always tell me like a different thing. Sometimes people tell me I have to sell the seeds. Sometimes I have to sell the crops. It's selling level two crops, I think, but I'm not. Yeah, 
I feel like I always hear something different, so I'm just like, <laughs> I'm gonna sell everything. But, yeah. So I should have kept the level 2 seeds, but anyway. So, what to... Oh, okay, so now we have to go to the tower, right? Um, 255. Um... Mm -mm. Okay, let me buy some recipe bread. Welcome. I want recipe bread. And... I still need to get a better armor, right? So, okay, let's buy some accessory bread. Oh, three more. Alright. Maybe some weapon bread. Take your time. And another accessory bread. And one more. Um, farming bread, I think. Uh, maybe I can try it. Anyway, no. Well, I have a few farming bread actually in my fridge. Wet boots, Lolita headdress, straw hat. I'm not getting any armors. I'm just getting like hats and boots. Basket. I didn't learn anything. Okay. I can make gloves. Monkey plush. That was I'm making cookies. Oh, what kind of cookies are you making? I haven't made cookies in such a long time. I haven't baked. I haven't done it a lot. Of I haven't done much actually. <laughs> um. All right. So let's go. Maybe take a bath. And yeah, let's take a bath. And let's go to the tower and see how feasible. Oh, we got a little cutscene. Josh, we found the culprit. No, we didn't, but we did find a rather helpful ally. Huh? So I heard you're looking for Omni Gate. Omni Gate? It's a moving magic that you use to summon something from the forest of beginnings. If you upgrade your shirt with magnifying glass, you can see the level of crops and growth. Oh, I didn't know that. Because that's good to know because I didn't like to always have to use the magnifying glass like as a tool But if you can put it on your shirt, that's I'm gonna try that right away actually I know someone who actually came back by using that magic. All right What it was a lucky coincidence I was searching for information on the person who returned from the first of beginnings and learned that someone in this town happens to know that person well But then Ember came in and I lost my focus. I wound up leaving empty-handed Oh no. I had actually sent Ember to the castle to search for clues. While I myself investigated the inn, I figured those are the two best places to begin, and then I got my lucky break. The water in the vase was dirty, you see? Hmm? What does mean? So I tried to change it, but it has dropped. It seems I will always be clumsy, and that stopped me from going home, and that's when I happened to be passing by. So it sits. Since I only had scraps for clues, I was worried I'd never be able to find him. How do you get the angler sprite? Um, so once you reach... I'm not sure when exactly. I think once you have 100 followers sprites in total, you're going to be able to go to the shrine and you'll be able to pay... Uh, I think it's 10 points and you'll be able to get the angler sprite. Um, and all the other sprites actually. Uh, since I only had scraps for clues, uh, yeah, okay. Uh, but thanks to that bandana, I recognized him instantly, so that's how you found me. So he's the one you were looking yes. for. Yes. So what's the magic that can bring someone back from the forest of beginnings? Right, it's a magic called Omnigate. If you'd like to learn it, I can teach you. Yes. Yeah, teach me. Yes, please. Just bear in mind that not everyone can use it. To be honest, I can't. It's a magic that only the Earth mates can use, and that's our current dilemma. Well, that should be no problem because I'm an Earthmate. What? What? Seriously? Then should I just go ahead and teach you? Yes, yeah, sure. That would be great. You can just craft a shepherd shirt if you want and just keep it on with your farm. Yeah, that's. Yeah. Well, I don't like my shirt is not very valuable right now, so. All right, let's give it a shot. There's someone you want to help within the first of beginnings, right? Then just think of that person's name inside your head. Now try to come up with some specific detail you know about that person. He's the very first garden who tried to save Venti. 
Okay, now say the spell name. Omnigate. What? No, no. <laughs> what? You all right? I suddenly felt so much power rushing into my body. Did you try to move an uncontroll uncontrollable number of runes? If you're just trying to summon a person over a monster, that shouldn't happen. What were you trying to call? I guess it's because Leon is still a guardian. Whoever it is, I don't think this spell is going to do the trick. Oh no. Then I'll have to go to the forest of beginnings myself. What? It's too dangerous. That's right. You don't know what's out there. There's no guarantee that you'll even get to the forest of beginnings. We already had an idea how to get inside. And as an earthmate, I'm the only one who can save him. So I'll enter the forest of beginnings from the large gate and use this magic. Uh, you can't do that. Omnigate is a magic to call something from the first of beginnings to where you are now. So if you use it there, it won't do a thing. I mean, it's designed to call something to begin with. You can't use it on yourself. Barret looks cool. Yeah, he does. But you can use this instead. What? It's a returning ring. With it, you can come back from the first of beginnings. Though it'll break after only one use. Wow, why did you get such a thing? If you wear hard pendant when you farm a mine or take a bath, you can skill up in your skill level. Oh, thank you so much for <laughs> all the tips. I used to research the ancient text of the Earthmates Earth script. I wanted to use Earthmates magic even though I wasn't an Earthmate myself. Partially so I could lend aid to the person I know who came back, but also to help out any request fools who feel invisible just because they are Earthmates. I'm sure you can all understand exactly what I mean. Yeah, I think so all too well. It doesn't take a detective to figure out what you're implying. Looking at you, it makes me realize all over again that you Earthmates are kind hearted but impossibly stubborn. Thank you very much. It's not, <laughs> it's not a compliment, sorry. Anyway, the ring reacts to your spell, so hold on to the person you want to save and chant Aris. Once you chant the spell, it will transfer both you and whatever you're holding. But you've only got one shot, so don't mess it up. I want to Josh, it's alright, I promise I'll save Venti. That's his favorite. Good luck, I'm afraid. But I have faith in you, thank you. Alright, okay, let's see if they have anything to say. Where is Leon Karnak? Yeah, actually, I know where it is. Yes. Okay, alright, so. Yeah, so. I think that would be a good point to end today's stream actually i just want to see so we're, we're gonna be approaching the end of today's stream but i just i really i'm curious to see how strong i want to know if i'm strong enough to <laughs> do because last time i tried doing there everybody is so strong so i want to see how that goes now if you want an easy heart pendant the request to give a moon drop to dolce will give you one. oh i see Alright, so I just want to see how strong everybody is in that area. I, I should have fast travel. This. Also, when you level up, you can crafting and mix medicine skill. I see. Leon Karnak is just beyond the gate, should be right over there. Once I enter the first of beginnings, I won't be able to come back. Alright, so let's save before we check that out. What level am I now? 49! Oh my gosh, we were we were at 32 when we started the stream today. You level up so fast in this game. If I go any further, I might never be able to come back. I should go alone. Oh no. Okay. Go home. You go home. 
you go home. I feel like that's gonna be a quite a challenge. All right, let's try. Yeah, I think <laughs> I think I might have to do some some more training, some more improving my equipment before I do this. I don't, I'm not sure. I don't know if I'm ready. Not too bad. The forest is calling me. All right. Let's go to the forest of beginnings. That's literally the final boss of Arc 1. Ooh, so we're going to have... I don't know. Well, I don't, I don't think... <laughs> I don't know if I'm going to go through all of this, but... That would be good if we can finish Arc 1 before Rune Factory 5. All right, wait for me, Venti. What's this? I wonder if I can walk. I can. I Something's pouring in. You might be under level. What difficulty level are you playing on? I'm on normal difficulty. If I become a guardian, I can save Venti, right? If so, then I honestly don't mind. I'll do whatever I have to. It's sad that I have to leave everyone else, but it's to help Venti know I can say goodbye. If Vent found out, she'd try to stop me. Is the door to the first of beginnings open now? I see everything will be okay soon. Until then, you know, one day when I wake up, I want to fly with Ben. We'll fly in this beautiful blue sky, just the two of us. So please save Ben. This is the one where you can turn into a llama. You can turn into a llama? <laughs> I'm not sure. I, maybe someone else can answer that, but I don't know. I feel like even these guys, they're like um, higher, like stronger versions of the normal dudes. Yeah, I don't think if, the, if they're already strong like this at the very beginning, I think I might have to level up a little bit more and improve my tools, my equipment a little bit more. Oh, is it just like one room per, like one room per dungeon? I'm not sure. If we don't do anything, then he might die, right? Alright, just tell me one last thing. Was I chosen as the guardian because I'm her best friend? I see. No, don't say anything to her. It would make her sad to know that I left for her sake. I'm just going to settle down for a long sleep. Don't worry, I'm used to waiting. I'll just think of it like a long vacation, a fishing trip. Oh, and when I awaken in a new world, I want to take it easy and go fishing with her. Even if we couldn't find a way to do it, one day someone will write a way to save Venti. So until that day comes, take care of Venti, will you? Uh, these guys are quite strong. Hmm. 
Ooh, just reached level 50. I think there are level 50, 70 enemies. Oh yeah. Uh, I just I just reached level 50 now, but yeah, um, I can feel already they're kind of kind of very strong. Yeah, I think. Ah. Well, all right. So I think <laughs> that's gonna be pretty much it for today, guys. So maybe next time. Well, next time. So I'm gonna see you guys on Sunday. I'm gonna play. Uh, Story of Seasons, Pioneers of Olive Town, and next Wednesday we're gonna be playing Rune Factory 5 for the very first time. So I'm definitely looking forward to that. If you don't want to miss out Rune Factory 5, there's gonna be tons of tons of Rune Factory 5 streams. So <laughs> you're gonna see them at one point. But if you don't want to miss the Rune Factory 5 stream next week, make sure you're there. So. Yeah, also if you've never joined the Discord, you can always join the Discord. The link is in the description, so feel free to check that out. And yeah, thank you so much guys for joining tonight. And yeah, that's pretty much it. So <laughs> alright, thank you. Bye bye.